There we go. How's it going, everybody? It's finally Wednesday, and you know what that means. It's time to stream again. So, uh, if you're wondering what whatever Wednesday is going to be, uh, it's something I've been thinking about for a while now. I have a selection of games I wanted to take a look at, and while not a fortune cookie per se, because I do pick the list of the games I wanted to check out, uh, yeah, I just wanted to check out uh, some games I picked up recently, and one of which was uh, a game of Inuyasha. And judging by what is going on with the screen, you're... Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, there we go. So, from the looks of it, it's a fighting game. Uh, we know how good I am when it comes to fighting games. Oh, God. Okay, looks like it's running now. Hold on, I need to fix that aspect ratio. Hi, Moon. Uh, let's... No, where is that? There we go. Move that over there. And need to fix a little on the right. There we go. Alright, now it's much better. <laughs> I, I take it that he, uh, you're excited to see me play this, and I'm sure you're excited to know that this actually exists. All right, so what do we got? Uh, Feudal Fairy Tale, find all the shards. I wonder if this is, actually has a story mode. I'm guessing this is one v one. Dream Fairy Tale, fight two on two uh, with a friend or uh, computer. Practice learning the controls. <laughs> uh, very. Uh, that's settings with Shippo. Okay. I guess, if anything, we'll do the story mode. I didn't think this game actually would have a story mode associated with it. I thought it was just a straight-up fighting game. Okay, so we only got Inuyasha and Kagome to pick. I guess it makes sense since, you know, it's starting off on the show, and then as we pr progress on, we'll probably unlock more characters of the cast. So, uh, we'll go with Inuyasha. Why not? Easy guard? No. Oh god. Japanese Inuyasha's voice sounds weird. <笑><笑>俺は犬屋社。様々な妖怪も Oh, that's it. There we go. You've collected zero shards. Please collect six shards of the Jewel of the Four Souls to get the shards of the Jewel of the Four Souls from the opponent with the Wind Scar back plus square. Something good might happen if you collect the shards. The commands are written in the characters facing right. Okay. Oh, oh my god, there's actually... I, I'm really digging the stage select. Right, what have we got down here? Meow. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna make the easy joke there. Oh, 
実はこの岩の隙間に四魂のかけらが挟まっておるんでございますが I, I know it's supposed to be close ups of the characters for these little portraits. It looks like Miyoga's ten feet tall. Just because of the fact they scaled him by that house, it's, it's kind of funny. Attack the upper left, lower left, upper right, and lower right of the rock to destroy it. Destroying the rock within the time limit、uh, to clear the game. Controls are the same. Oh god, I, I probably should have done the training real quick. Oh, this is gonna be fun. But you know what? I'm a trial by fire kind of guy. Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, there we go. Ah,、uh, no, it's bottom right or bottom left. Damn it. We almost had it there for a second. Yes, I can see the bee is hitting me. Oh, were we supposed to just destroy most of the rock? God, as someone who grew up watching the Toonami version of this, so it was the、uh, English version, hearing the Japanese voices for the characters sounds really weird. Alright,、uh, let's see what right here is. Meow. Oh god, I just realized. If that's what Inuyasha sounds like, I'm, I'm scared to hear what Shippo sounds like. Sorry about that. I had a really bad cough come up. <laughs> Extinguish the flames from the Staff of Skull by attacking them. If you can inflict a blow on Jakim within the time limit, you win. So just hit him once, got it. I ran right into the flame before it start. Before it、uh, happened. Oh, God. Bye, Shippo! <laughs> Bees! Oh, my God! Ah, damn it. There we go. Ah, no! I. Get it! No! Inyasha, please! What you have to say in the chat. I hate this face. Damn it, I'm really feeling angry. 
Can I do this challenge again, I hope? No. Oh, does he move to a different location? Or is it actually a one-time deal with the jewel shards? Honestly, not as annoying as I thought it would be. No, what I was supposed to do was I was supposed to knock his flames away and then hit him once to finish his challenge, but I kept hitting the wrong button because his claw attack is on the square button, even though the wind scar attack is with the uh, back square. To use the Tetsaiga, I have to use the circle button. I just keep forgetting. Actually, never tried what Triangle does. We'll, we'll see that again. We'll see if we can use it against Shippo. I take, I take back what I said about Shippo, by the way. Oh god, how's hitting Shippo gonna work? Because he's very... Oh god, he is very small. Oh. I refuse to get my ass kicked by Shippo of all people. God. Uh-oh. What? Top! Top! Okay, uh... Special attack. Alright, Iron Reaver square. Windscar's back square. Blades of Blood. Uh, right square while in the air. Dragon Twister down down square. I did it too late. I cannot believe that Shippo kicked my ass. Of all people. Well, we failed. We couldn't even beat Shippo. Although, when it comes to, like, characters on the field, I guess it does let you refight them, so that's good. So I'm wondering if after we do, we do like, a character fight, the, like, the field challenges will come back. Alright, there's Blades of Blood. There's Wind Scar. There's Iron Reaver. Throw more shippos at me! One ship was enough! There it is. Ooh! Uh oh! Top! Oh! Okay, okay, oh! And there I go.
I get that transforming the Shippo's thing, but geez, he even gets to copy their mo uh, the character's moves. No, I will not let Shippo beat me. I refuse to lose to this little bastard. Hey, Inuyasha, ship was up there, not down there. What are you looking at? Okay, one hit knocks him out of the transformation at least, so that's good to know. Oh, he's got a top ready. I need to be careful. Got him. Look at that smug look on his face. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I wonder, is the well a uh, character swap? Nope, it's just the space. What about the tree? Tree does nothing. Okay. I I guess we'll go fight Sushonamaru then. Kind of figured that the well of all things would be a character selector. Yeah, it, it figures that he'd have a good, uh, a pretty good voice. Compared to Inu Yasha, it's like night and day. Which, I guess for Inu Yasha's VA, they want to have someone come off as, like, brash and cocky, which makes sense for the character. John, can you get back here with that shard? Ooh. Jeez. Wait. Oh, come on. There we go. Jeez, why was the Shomaru an easier character to fight than Shippo of all people? Is it like supposed to be one? Isn't he like supposed to be one of the strongest characters in the series? Like both VAs and the English cast. Yeah, the English cast does a pretty good job. これが犬屋さ様の実力だ。風の匂いが変わった。これはなら
それに向こうからは嫌な匂いが近づいてきやがるこうしちゃいられねえさっさと神楽のところへ行くぜはい、まあ、先生、で、tell me to go there。あ、この、explore everything else and see、uh, what there is to find。よう、さんご。なんだ、平い骨の手入れしてんのか。あ、イニアシャ。これは退治屋としての大切な道具だからね。ふーん。だけど、手入れようか。本当は、弥勒のそばにいる方がいいんじゃねえのか。何言ってんのよ、イニアシャン。なあ、にやかい顔してやがんね。平い骨が燃えちまうぞ、サンゴ。イニアシャン、私をからかうなんて絶対に許さない。Oh dear. Oh, we fight サンゴ。I thought, I thought that was going to be a, just like a field challenge because she wasn't like a character on the screen. It's actually a pretty nice looking battlefield, I have to say. That's a... Wait, what's that? Oh, that charges my uh, special meter. Cool. Oh no, not kill Allah! This is bad. Ah, missed. Ah, oh, well, still got her. Man, I gotta say, the animation for this game is actually pretty fluid. It's kind of impressive. Alright, guess we'll head over here. And whatever this is. Loading, loading. Ah, Moroku. Nande, Miroku Janega. Do Sandeo, Sona Shinken Nakaoste. Iniasa, Eka and Kagome Samani, Jibun no Kimucho Haki to Stadra don't understand. Sit in the Taita, O Minor, the Skebe Hosini, Toyaka, you are the Sushiwa. どうやら言葉で言ってもお前には分かってもらえないようですねへえこの俺とやろうってのかよいい根性してるじゃねえかさあかかってきなあはいタイムとどうやらやるのシリーズでやるのかおがいいかフリップや。Makes sense he's got a staff after all. I wonder, are there any other special attacks? Nope, that is just it for Inuyasha. Oh god, I think I know exactly what his super attack is. Shard. Wind tunnel. Yep, I knew it. Give it. Ah, uh, no, there's the shard. 
So, do I still get that shard, or... Oh, I get raided by Dragon. Apparently, he got got the boy some, wanting some ice cream. Alright, hold on. Let me get the guns real quick. How's it going, dude? Dragon, thank you so much for the raid. Hope your stream went well. I see that you fixed that issue with the uh, sound in your stream, which is good to hear. Tonight's a whatever Wednesday where I basically take a look at some games that I picked out recently and wanted to, you know, have a look, see how they are and such. And we're starting the night off with some Yasha. Also, hopefully you didn't get more of the boys killed during your stream tonight. But ho hope you you're having fun with the game, dude. Alright, nothing else to do, so I guess we'll just make our way... What are you doing? Alright, let's go. あんたまだ生きてたのかい。ちょうどいい。ここで会ったが100年目だ。いい加減蹴りをつけようじゃないか。へ。よそのところだ。鉄斎が出てめえの生けすかねえ風ごと叩きってやるぜ。私の風とあ
ープしやがる<笑>犬やシャカ貴様ごときがここまで来るとはな So my games are lined up for tonight. Well, Inuyasha for starters, and the rest you'll have to wait and see. <laughs> I can't go spoiling everything at the at the start of the stream, dude. Oops. Finger slipped. Do Pac-Man 99 tomorrow, since it looks like a late release for tonight. Uh, no, Pac-Man 99 is actually already out. Like, I already have it downloaded onto my Switch. And people have already been playing it. Oh god, the bees! Not the bees! Oh dear! Got him. Ah, uh, he guarded. I just realized he has four shards on him. Well, now three shards. Maybe I can... Maybe I can get all the shards off him. There we go. There's another one. Oh no, not again! Welcome back, Moon. Ah, uh, uh, he got me at the very end. Oh, it's not playable yet? Oh, I thought it was. Damn it, we had him dead to rights. <laughs> no, it is just rechecked. Oh, okay then. Alright, let's try this again. Hopefully I can get those jewel shards this time. Oh, hold the foot. I'm sorry, uh, what'd you say, Dragon? Ninjala's doing a Monster Hunter collab? Well, now I have to look this up. Because... I haven't really talked about it a whole lot, but I've been getting really into the new Monster Hunter game. Ah, jeez! Ah, counter, come on, counter! Check Twitter. I will write when we go to intermission. Got him. Ah, the bees. Okay, well. What is going on? Oh! Oh, dude! That looks awesome! Oh, it's got one of my favorite armor sets from Rise as well. Damn! Are right, Kiki's spear carrier carriers in the background? Uh, that is a good question, Moon. Anyways, uh, Naraku's a cheating bastard. Oh, 
What the hell? Who's that? Oh, I think that was his alter ego, uh, like alter ego or something. I don't remember a lot of Inuyasha. <laughs> Bees! Get the shirt, Inuyasha, please. Roots! Nope, nope. Saved it. Got him. Wait, why am I Nick Cage, dragon? Oh. And we got three of the four shards, at least. Oh, yelling at be about bees. Honestly, as much as I remember enjoying Inuyasha, the, the bees were such a contrivance in that sh show. It, I hated those things. There we go. And here we have a very annoyed looking Iuyasha. Six wins, four losses, uh, max three combos, number of shards, 11 pieces. Meow. Miyoga's secret room. In possession, 11 pieces, target, six pieces. Oh, you seem to have collected many shards of the sacred jewel. Allow me to hold on to them for you. Hmm, this tornado. It would seem that Koga has arrived. Oh, I see. So you collect jewel shards, and I guess if you hit the quota, uh, it unlocks a new character for you to fight, and probably, uh, or do you fight them, or is it actually just they're unlocked and uh, you can now play as them? This reeks of '90s anime, and I love it. Well, seeing as how that's what Yasha was, and uh, funny enough, actually got a sequel series a, a few, uh, I think last year or uh, two years ago. Or not last or two years ago. I mean, early this year. Nope, oh, nope. We only just got Koka. All right. Since we beat uh, it with Yasha, uh, we'll do one more run and then we'll probably call it for this game. But this game's pretty fun. Uh, who should we play as? Should we play as Kagome or Koga? Which K do you want me to pick? While that's happening, uh, I'm gonna drop this into the Discord. Where is it? Kagome, of course. Didn't really get to break the weekend. Working, uh, 5 to 11.30 Saturday. Ugh, that sounds disgusting, dude. And Moon says to pick Kagome, so let's pick her. Yeah, Kagome's voice sounds alright. Technically, also, since I beat it with Inuyasha, that counts as me beating the game this uh, month. Which means that gets added to the backlog, and also need to make a list to make sure I got uh, it checked off as a game we beat. Alright. Yeah, since it's a hot weekend at ADQ, 
that now has the patio open and allows people to come in and order on the patio. <coughs> also, if I remember right, this weekend's supposed, uh, the, I guess technically my weekend, but for the rest of the week it's supposed to get like really stormy and stuff. Which means the humidity is going to just skyrocket, which is going to be fun. Alright, collected two shards. Uh, please collect five shards of the jewel for a new character. Purification arrow, right plus square. Something might good happen if you collect the shards. Alright. Uh, oh, I need to be in a fight. Alright, so we've got Shippo, Iviasha, Sashomaru, uh, K Kikyo? Okay. So, I rain clouds earlier today at work, but nothing happened. Ah. And then we got the three uh, challenges. So, of course, we gotta go fight Inuyasha. Surprise, it's not at the tree and it's at the well. Really cannot stand this voice. Yeah, his voice is really annoying. No offense to the voice actor, but just, yeah, not a fan of Ian Yasha's voice. Don't you just hate it when couples fight? Ow! Just come swinging right out of the gate, huh, Yasha? Alright, what do we got? Spiritual power, square, curse deflection, back square, arrow is right, square, special attack is the sacred arrow. Damn it, blocked. I, I like that her, her her shield thing is just basically her getting really angry and yelling. I'm just gonna keep him at a distance. I got this bow right here, so of course I gotta use it! I had to keep- I had to open my big mouth. I had to open my big mouth. You see what happens when I open my mouth? Bad things happen. <laughs> uh, even if I lose, I still win. Oh, the game over screen is also different for each character. That's cool. You know, honestly, going into this game, I wasn't expecting much, but I'm actually really enjoying it. And yeah, I get my ass kicked every now and then, but I'm I'm not the best when it comes to fighting games. But I'm actually enjoying this one uh, a lot lately. Uh, 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 counter! Damn. Don't you be taking my shard. Uh, 
blocked it. Ah, come on, get up, get up! Ah, damn it! But yeah, the Time Wars got in the first fight against the Exylvanians and just went fuck this after the second defeat. My brain is too burnt out to do tactics. All right, try number three. I will say, I kind of dig Yasha's uh, special abilities more than Kagome's. God damn, thought I could evade it. God! Come on, get it! Ah, he's blocking again. There we go, got him. Fighting noises. Well, it's not a smug zine, Yasha, so I like it more. Alright, uh, let's go to the tree, I guess. We'll just do one big loop and then we'll meet uh, back up at the castle. Oh, that's Miyoka. I think I know what this is. Yep, break the rock. Ah, the bees! Got it. Oh dear. You'll have to tell me when we uh, jump into the next game. And you, can, and you can talk all about this Friday Night Funkin' that you thing you're working on. Oh. Still looks like he's 10 feet tall. Damn. <laughs> so long as teeth isn't involved, I don't think I'll get angry. All right, Shomaru, let's do this. Oh, 
The, the, the tone of her voice and the little, like, uh, hesitance there sounds like she's scared. That look just is, like, pure, unfiltered un, uh, annoyance. Week 6 through 7, you need to keep it as is. Week 6. This one. <laughs> you. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Kagome's kind of broken with her arrows. Just keep shooting arrows into enemies and basically they can't get anywhere near you. I don't think I've seen Sus uh, Susomaru's special ability yet. Oh, there it is. Of course, it would be his demon form. Didn't do him any good. It's like Fang from Sonic Fighters. Or Sonic the Fighters. Oh, there's a smugness. I mean, I guess. We have to at some point. Also, that's the happiest I've ever seen Kikyo. I, I get it's supposed to be Kagome's ancestor, and so they just share the same animation, or I guess idol animation. But still, if you know anything about her character from the sh show, she is a big downer. Granted, she's a living corpse and shouldn't even be alive and was brought back by black magic, but still. <laughs> oh god, do I have to fight both of them? Oh no, I have to fight both of them at the same time! Hopefully it's at least one after the other. And Kaguya has a shard on her. Oh, oh, what is this? What is this? Uh, is she like a super meter instead of like backup? Get her. Uh, all right, still got her. Oh, I don't have to fight Kaguya? Just pure annoyance with everything. 
Okay, so scrolling Twitter, apparently in Mario Sunshine, you can dismount the uh, Mario at the blooper in the Rico Harbor Red Coin mission. You have to crash into a piñata that's in the floaty. Oh, I didn't know that. Nope, nope, it's Moroku. That is not the sound of pat pat. That's that's more of the sound of squish squish. <coughs> not that I would know anything about that. <laughs> Stop it. He is just annoyed with uh having to fight someone. Oh, he's got shards on him. Got him. Got the shirt. Gotta watch out for the wind tunnel. And he's done. <laughs> I kind of like that, uh, it seems like her victory animations are dependent on the character. Like, if, if it's, like, an antagonist of the series, then it's, like, she she gets cocky and smug at the fact that she was able to win. If it's against, if it's against one of her friends, she actually looks like she has concern that she kicked her ass. And then when it's Kikyo, it's, uh, absolute just annoyance and also somewhat, uh, just... What, whatever her emote was when we fought Kikyo. Careful, he might be into it. Alright, Shippo. It's time for a rematch. I like that the the thing that sets Kagumi off is just basically Shippo hungry, need food. Granted, every Shippo fight so far has been Shippo's annoying to the gang and they want to beat him up for it. Which is something I can get behind. Jeez, I forgot how annoying Shippo is, though. Yeah. 
Oh, he's got the top! Ah, jeez! Alright, you know what? Screw this. It's against Shippo. I don't care. Of course, now he chooses not to guard. There we go. Surprised he didn't uh, throw another top at me, although I guess I got I kept uh, him on the defensive too long. Nope, ship was dead. Ah, oh, no! Well, so much for whatever was here. I figured it was... I don't know. I, I figured it was still going to be there, and it was just like the prelude to the castle. And I did it by beating up a small child. Tone and vo a voice says, I'm prepared to take you down. Look is just straight up annoyance. Not gonna lie, annoy Kagome is kind of my spirit animal uh, at this point. Yep, why did we come here alone? Alright, we got two shards, he's got four shards. Makes sense. He is the quote-unquote final boss of this. Why not? True. Up oh, there's one. Uh, of course, I, since I got him trapped in the corner, I can't get any shards from him. There we go. Oh, nope. <laughs> Jeez, that has a long range on it. There's three shards. And there's four. And he's dead. <laughs> wow, that was easier than it was with Inuyasha. And thus the day is saved. As Kogome sits at the edge of the well, contemplating all the lives that she has taken. Alright, that was actually a lot better than it was the first time around, which makes sense. I had more uh, time to get used to the game. And we got 15 shard pieces, which is impressive. Alright, 15 pieces. Targeted was 5, so we well exceeded. We might actually be getting two characters. You cannot look inside Kagome's backpack. I wonder what's inside it. That monk over there. It would seem that's Moroku is now your ally. Mario Kart level in 3D world is so much better without lag. Alright, what what is the backpack? 
uh, look at pictures, play mini games, and listen to music. Change the sound, play mini games, listen to music. Look at pictures, which I'm guessing are just stills from the show. Yeah, more pictures. Oh, no, it's character portraits. Yeah, it looks like it's also still from the show as well. All right, change the sound. That's just probably sound settings. But we'll see. Whose voice would you like? What? Switch tag out. Change the tag out spoken when switching with Koga, Maroku, or Kagome. Don't fall asleep. Kagome's scary when she gets angry. Inuyasha's switch with me. Ha. It's better than. Can you handle it? This is bad. How's that? It's about time. Oh, wait. Can I? Kagome! Uh, we're gonna change uh, Moroku to Ha, <laughs> and K uh, Koga will tell him not to fall asleep. For the match, come on! I'll take you on. Let's go! Come on! Why? Let's see, for Gagome, we'll pick... Uh, well, she'll tell people that she will cut them in half. Moroku... Uh, he's gonna tell people to taste his claws. Oh no, wait, this is Inuyasha to the character. Okay. All right, uh, just come on. And the win. Uh, it'll be right on. Very assertive that he's going to forgive Kagome. Moroku, uh, it's going to, no, uh, we're, we're just going to bark at Moroku. And we're going to insult Koga by telling him that he's weak. And the draw. Can't. I'm not gonna let it end like this. Uh, we're gonna tell Kagome not to come near Kagome. Uh, we're gonna tell Moroku that he he shook us up. And we're going to tell Koga it's all about the ears. All right, there we go. All right, mini games, what do we got? <clears throat> oh, I, I see. So it's like the, the mini games that we did in the story mode, which is the rock smashing. I'm guessing that would be the, the fire beat back and whatever the third one was. All right. Well, yeah, this actually was a pretty fun game. I had a lot of fun with it, and I'm surprised we actually managed to beat it. I might return to it at some point in the future and maybe uh, try out the other characters, but yeah, definitely would recommend this if you can find it. It's actually a pretty fun fighting game. And this is coming from someone who is terrible at fighting games. But for now, let us go to intermission. And let me get set up for the next game. Now, the next game is actually a game that is a part of, this, of a series that I did about a year ago and also did an LP of about five, year, five or four years ago. I don't remember exactly when. <clears throat> 
And in keeping up with the fact that I do not want to play Lost Planet 3 anytime soon, uh, we're going to play the spin-off game that came out uh, on the PS3, which is EX Troopers. So I'm going to get that set up, get some water, and also probably open up for code comments for tonight. And when we get back, we will start some EX Troopers. So see you all then.
All right, and I'm back. <clears throat> and window for CoComs is now open. So let's get into the game, shall we? My room is 85 degrees. That's about the same as my room. I want to die. <laughs> uh, so did I today. So did I. So how are you two doing tonight? I think you take a guess. Uh, I'm going to say that you're perfectly well and that there's no issues whatsoever. Uh... <laughs> oh no, this game's fully in Japanese. Hopefully I can swap things to English. Well, uh, time to bust your Duolingo, TVG. Uh, uh, well, I've been playing a lot of Yakuza, so don't worry, my Duolingo is sharp as ever. Uh, if you hear knocking at your door and you hear an owl hooing, don't answer it. Why? He knows you haven't been studying your Japanese, TVG. <laughs> So, this right here is basically uh, Lost Planet, the anime. <laughs> Wait, what? So, so, you know about the Lost Planet series, right? No. Uh, <laughs> Lost Planet was a Capcom title back during the early PS3 and 360 years. And it, it was a really good game. It was like, it's basically a cult classic. It got a sequel a few years later, and it's one of my favorite underrated series, even though we don't talk about the third game that doesn't exist. And basically, this is a sort of anime manga spin-off of the series that I've been really interested in taking a look at for the longest of times. <laughs> it also is on the 3DS of all things. And apparently they got, like, a well-known anime studio to animate an I the intro to it. But only for the 3DS version. This definitely looks like anime. Mm-hmm. I know a lot of people don't, from what I've heard, don't like this game because it's so different and not what Lost Planet is. But again, it's not a, even a mainstay game in the series. It's a spin-off. That's the point of it being so, a spin-off. You know, it's an experiment. Exactly. <laughs> Spin-off, you can basically do whatever the hell you want with the series. You're saying, you know how everyone hates Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts? Yeah, but that's also a spin-off. Yeah, but see, I consider just a canon spin-off. It's like the Luigi's Mansion series. They're a spin-off, but they're still canon to what goes on in the actual Mario universe. Exactly. Alright, let's do this. You know, so I actually like... I actually like... I If I could speak... I actually like Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, but I have a bias there since it was actually my first Banjo Kazooie game. Oh, I can't get anything extra. All right, fine. New game it is. Uh, okay, what? Circle is the button to press. Yeah, it's in Japanese, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I see. Circle is confirmed there. I did not know that. All right, I think I. All right, what's this? Yeah, why do you think uh, whenever that's the credits? Whenever uh, in games, when you get something correct, a circle pops up. It, it's confirmation. I hate that you're right about that. <laughs> what was that bang, Moon? You okay? That was him. no. That was my head hitting my desk. <laughs> <laughs> For once, it Yo. wasn't me bashing my head into the desk. <laughs> you okay, TPG? Uh, I don't know. Should I be smelling colors? <laughs> I smell purple. It smells grapey. Uh, when I was, I forget what grade it was, but one time in school, it was elementary school, we took a field trip to the grocery store and we looked about a bunch of different foods there. <laughs> I'm sorry, wait, hold on. Ho hold the phone. You took a field trip to a grocery store? <laughs> yes, we took a field trip to one of our giant eagles there near us, and it was to learn about food groups. Mm -hmm. I mean, okay, makes sense, but still, that's a weird place to go on a field trip to. Uh, we got to eat free ham. Like, like, 
the entire ham? Or no, they were, they handed out like like little ham slices to us to try out. I know, but just thinking that you know they just handed a bunch of elementary school kids just giant pieces of ham. <laughs> <laughs> and we also got a uh, erasers in the in like grape erasers, and they actually smelled like grapes. Did okay. I have to ask: Did anyone try to eat them? I cannot remember. Probably. I'm surprised I didn't give another kid that tried collecting pine cones. Oh, you know this is super anime when the main character is a hyperactive spazball and also has pink hair. Uh. I heard Pink Care and I'm just thinking Marluxia from Kingdom Hearts. Nah, not long enough. <laughs> Dude, fuck Marluxia's fight in Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. I would know that. The only time I've ever fought him would be in Kingdom Hearts 3, and I, he was kind of easy in that game. Do you, Okay, in Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix, uh, a lot of the Organization 13 members got bonus fights that were in the original game, Marluxia being one of them. And you wanna, each one of them had a gimmick. Marluxia's gimmick was, you had a counter above you linked to your level. That's how many times you could get hit. Ouch! Yeah, so if you're level 20, you're gonna get hit 20 times. On top of your normal HP bar getting depleted as well. Ow, jeez. And he loved comboing you! Huh. Oh hey, I know, I know that model. I've seen Luckily. this style of game before. Sorry. Luckily, manga style. I played. A oh no, game. it's the JoJo thing. I played a game similar to it. The only other game I could think of that adapts this like style to it would be Codename Steam. Rusty Hearts. Never heard of it. It was on Steam a long time ago. Huh. I, I was trying to say. Luckily, there was a way to uh, reset, at least bring the counter back up a bit. You do want to tag with the Apostle Moon if you could dodge him. You could do a reaction command to uh, go into a quick time event to reset the counter. Ah. So we're not going to understand the plot are at all, are we? Uh, unless I can figure out how to change the subtitles from Japanese to English. <laughs> Probably not. Whoa, holy shit, it's a huge robot in a bubble! In the feudal position, because they always are in anime. He's breaking out. Oh. <laughs> okay, you know how some games are better to speedrun in Japanese? Yes. Guess what language slide 2 is best to speedrun in? Oh no. Uh, French. Korean. <laughs> huh. Hmm, interesting. Also, Moon, you know how you said I was worried about the race of TBG? Uh... Which race? The Slide 2 one you're wanting to do. Uh-huh. Oh, I thought you were talking about our Battalion Wars one that's coming. I am not doing a race with you in Battalion Wars. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, Moon, I'm not worried scared? because I actually know a small bit of speedrunning stuff for Slide 2 as well. Not as much as Slide 1, but I know a small bit that can help me for Slide 2. <laughs> okay, also, by the way, this uh, race is going to be glitchless, so... <laughs> Well, some of the speedrunning tech I'm doing aren't glitches, so... Oh. I, I like how we're not even paying attention to the, po uh, to the plot of this. It's not like we'll understand it. <laughs> <laughs> this doesn't know, look take, right! Uh, visual this cues. doesn't look right! <laughs> uh, anime game. Robot, big robot. You pile them. They go... Go shoot... He was sitting in the guy's lap and it didn't look right because he was just Bad like adjusting guys. himself. <laughs> like, I don't know. He looks like he's having a good a good time. Yeah, I want. I want. You're driving crazy. He seems excited. Because, uh, I'm buffering. Uh, no, not for me. Okay, then it's probably just me. Just making sure. All right. Uh, yeah. Okay. So uh, this. And, uh, this? Okay, let's go. <laughs> Alright, trial by fire, because I have no idea what the button inputs are. Okay, just Fun. for a second. 
regarding Kingdom Hearts, uh, it's on PC now. How the fuck do you play Kingdom Hearts with a keyboard and a mouse? Oh god! Oh, okay. Okay, so from the looks of things, I just need to line up the reticule. Oh, I, I need to hit the fire button, too. Yes, that's typically how you shoot things. Ah, uh, jeez. Uh, Got it. It's nice that those missiles did nothing. So is this the entire game? I don't know. It's what this segment is. Probably. Oh, that is that that is so anime hurts. If that if that's not the whole gameplay, then that's a little weird to open it up with. What's that? I can't hear you over all the anime. Yeah! Jesus Christ. This is painful. <laughs> <laughs> this is great, I don't know what we, you're on. We thought the last game was anime. It was! Literally! Literally. This is anime anime. Double anime. This is future anime. I'm someone who's watched a lot of mecha anime uh, in his time. This... Looks like om about almost all of them. Mm. Is Mario hey. technically anime given he was made in Japan? Uh, mm, no. <laughs> yes and no. Because stuff like the Super Show, that's not anime. That, that's like far from being anime. Well, there's also the, the manga. That's right, there was a manga. Yep. Yeah. And it also has, uh, I would say, the best iteration of Peach, where she takes no shit from anybody. Wait, TBG, that wasn't a manga. Are you thinking of the, uh, the one that was in Nintendo Power? No, I think it was the manga Peach that was like that. Was there a joke where a guy sold Mario and Luigi a Yoshi translator, and the, and the whole thing was just Yoshi? No. Okay, then. Okay, now here's a question. Does Mario Bonna Dunny uh, a, a, a bunny costume? I don't remember. Just what I remember was uh, Bowser did something to Mario. Uh, Peach was uh, still... Uh, I think it was, he, she was either captured by him or she was still in her castle. Was Mario and, turned to stone? Uh, I think so. No, that's remember. that's a Nintendo Power comic, not a manga. Because I uh, have that. Oh, that's Nintendo... Oh, okay. I ju it just has my favorite thing in there, where Bowser's just like, I'm gonna leave you to think about our relationship and stuff. He leaves, yeah, that's, that's... she takes no shit and jumps out the window after him, yeah, that, threatening to keep the his comic. ass. That's the comic from Nintendo Battle. Uh, uh, damn, I thought that was the manga. There is a manga, and Mario at one point goes into a Playboy bunny costume. Uh. <laughs> I'm not joking. I... That, that sounds incredibly cursed. <laughs> it is. He uh, also at one point we all know Luigi would one. be the one who does it. We all know it'd be Luigi who'd be in the in the bunny costume. Do I need to send the video I sent you into? Okay, the video I sent you, TV. Do I need to send that into like the Discord? S send it. Let everybody else. Oh sure. god, I think I hear Moon laugh. Uh. Hold on. Hello, Mario. <laughs> Where should I put it? My, as Italian as Italians can be, Luigi. <clears throat> Hello, Mario. <laughs> that, that's how it goes, Moon. TBG, where should oh, I put I this? I gotta see this, TV so... Talk? Yeah, put it in TV Talk. I'm, I'm tempted to send the full thing, where it's like going over everything that's in the video. Oh, God. Alright, uh... Alright. Left stick, right uh, stick, L1 to shoot, I'm gonna guess. 
Yeah. Well, I'm gonna turn you two down so I can hear this. I don't know what L1 does. But at least I got the basics of... Alright, let's see. That's that. That's... Oh, right. Alright, that's that. I'm... I'm scared to see if that's quit. Oh, okay. Okay, we're somewhere. Alright, that's controls. Marley, you good over there? Alright, no, don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. My kanji is incredibly rusty. What's this? Okay, that's sound, voice, and sound effects. I'm guessing you finished watching it, Moon. <laughs> Alright. Oh, the dash. <laughs> and here's okay, a bunch so of the Luigi to give you a bunch boost. of information. Hello, Mario. Oh, hold it. <laughs> 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 Alright, circle to use a grappling hook, it seems. Okay, I'm starting st the full thing because, Moon, I shit you not, that is from a sex ed video <gasps> involving Nintendo characters. <laughs> and here come the acrid. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna. What even is the design of this weapon? Hold on, hold on, I need to look at this. It looks like the Solar Empire's, like, assault rifle, but this really weird, like, like, shoulder guard that's an underside. But at the same time, I'm guessing those are holders for more clips, but, oh, man, this thing looks super weird. Here, this is actually a better view. Like, this looks like a Battalion Wars gun. Dude, you look at his butt. <laughs> I'm looking at his butt, I'm looking at his gun. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Guys, I watched a small bit of it and it reeks of fucking 80s cheese. Oh god. Well, there was a lot of cheese in the 80s, that's why there was a milk shortage. I I, I, I sent it. It is just. Even the thumbnail is like, oh, what the fuck? Oh no. Oh, okay, I guess I'm gonna turn you guys down again. Jesus. What even is this pose Peach is doing? It's just like, hmm. Yeah, but look what's getting highlighted. Is that a flower? TBG, you know damn well what they're highlighting in that image. Uh, something with an eyeball. Alright, uh, square to shoot your weapon, triangle to, I'm guessing, throw grenades. Oh, no, it's a... Uh, what is this thing? That That is the weirdest looking... How many barrels should we put on this shotgun? Oh, yes. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Alright, R1, 2, I'm gonna what guess... Uh, running animation? Target specific enemies. Oh, there is melee here. Roadhouse. <laughs> that that is definitely a roadhouse roundhouse kick. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I need an acre to spawn. Am I there we watching? Go. What is this? Roadhouse. What is this? Roadhouse. <laughs> I think I think I'm breaking mood of what I sent him. Oh my <laughs> god, it's cursed. <laughs> Hello, Moon. No, don't talk to me like that. It scares me. <laughs> Very well, then. <laughs> oh, God, too fast. <laughs> so, we need to do a movie night of watching the Mario Sex Education video. TBG, guess who they use as their example for, uh... I can't. For I can't. the... As a male example for reproduction. I thought, I thought you were going to say an example of the female anatomy. No. I'm gonna guess Yoshi. Toad. Oh no. They knew what they were doing. <laughs> they knew exactly what they were doing. I'm tempted to make a joke and I think Moon will die if I say it. I'm just gonna get out of here. 
Fuck, I'm gonna see Backing it. up. Things come in small packages. Back. Backing up. So is that why Toad is the fastest character in the oh Mario series? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you never know. Oh shit! Action dive! He's so scared that his hair turned white. I, I feel I feel like tonight is just gonna be full of cursed stuff. Oh, uh, you you're gonna see a uh, curse when we get to the next game on the list. Oh no! I don't know. Yes. I don't know what could be what could be more cursed than what I send into TV talk. Uh, you'll have to wait and see. Huh? <laughs> Nani? Is he Shulk? <laughs> I see a girl. Oh, she's so pretty. She's shining. <laughs> and he's dead. Oh, wow, they even brought the helicopters from Lost Planet 2 in here. God, I, I've, I've joked about making a drinking oh, game with these things because in Lost Planet 2, these things get knocked out of the sky so many times. It's take a shot every time you see one get shot down. Of course, this guy with the mole's gonna be the bad guy, I guarantee ya. Well, well yeah, he did like the hair swish thing. Cause I am looking more and I'm... a best. It, he, The only way he could portray himself more as a villain is if he had glasses so he could just push him up with his middle finger. And I'm the really cheery, preppy girl that really likes the bad guy. I feel like she's gonna be the love interest for this hapless dumbass that we have to play as. Oh man, if only she noticed me. Notice me, senpai. <laughs> A girl's gonna be completely brainless. He's not a bad guy. Who knows? You say you say that when we can't understand what they're saying. Oh, I'm because pretty Mykonji sure. Is still really rough. I'm just. But at the same time, she she could be like a freaking genius, and we're all just making fun of her. <laughs> cool. We uh, beat it in Ichiban. I didn't know this was a Yakuza game. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Tiki. Kanata ni miru. Nagare boshi no iru o tsuge nasai. Kurenai deshita. Anime. So I have mini Oreo brownies. Ooh. So sorry if you hear crinkly of me opening this. Okay, so apparently the 3DS version of EX Troopers is English translated. But not the PS3 version. That's super freaking weird. Well, to be fair, uh... I don't think the PS3 version got localized. That's why it's all in Japanese. Even, like, uh, the menu stuff. But the 3DS version seems to be the 
a localization uh, version. Mm. Although there are people who are, from what I can see, uh, wanting to do like an English translation of it. These brownies are kind of crap. I'm going to eat them anyway because I'm hungry. <laughs> These are garbage. Oh. That garbage just eh. I just have actual freaking Oreos. Demo, no Part of me kind of wants to. If I actually like this more than I thought I am, which going into this, I heard bad things about it, but I'm having a good time with it. I'm wondering if maybe I could find the translation version, maybe make it into a series, but have it translated. God, this guy just looks like a codenamed Steam character. Grandpa! TBG, you know you must do. No. <laughs> no. Silence, young man! <laughs> Grandpa is talking! <laughs> <laughs> Where's my cranberry juice? Oh god. No, I don't like cranberries. I'm allergic. I need prune juice. <laughs> <laughs> but Grandpa, you were right here to shopping list. Cranberry juice. Yes, that's what I said. Prune juice. That's my grandson. That's my other grandson. Okay, okay, Granddad, which one's the favorite? Yes! <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Uh, so, speaking of space, the new Among Us map is out. Then it's. Not really in space, then, is it? Since it's the well, Among Us is linked to space, so I, I, I didn't know how to segue it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll do Among Us some night. I, I played the map I already. I would like to take a look at the, the it map. Is, it is, how is big. It? big. <laughs> oh no. Also, uh, in the trailers, you saw where there's a little platform where you get to get, go across from side to side to cross the gap? Yes. You can't call it to the over, over to the other side. You have to be on the same side as it. Oh. Uh, th that that could be either really good or really dirty, depending on uh what you are. That's my grandson, all right. Granddad, it's time for your nap. It's only one in the afternoon. Grandpa, it's two. It's two in the afternoon. Oh man, I'm I'm sleepy. Daylight savings. Uh, uh, something. Uh, oh, <laughs> my controller turned off. <laughs> I just heard some strange rumblings. I don't know what they were. It's a ghost. Do not fucking say that. I have a Ouija board in my closet and I hate it. <laughs> He's a dork. Oh, so he's you. I'm not blonde. <laughs> Moon, get the bleach. No. No! Well, make that hair blonde. <laughs> Over my dead body, you will. We both know Tamil would hold you down and let us do it. <laughs> I would sooner have the pink hair of the protagonist before I go blonde. You heard him, dragon. Pink Wait, hair. Wait, shit, no! So we're setting up a donation goal. Don't you even dare. Set up a donation goal to get TBG's hair bright, hot, pink. 
I just got my paycheck. Only if I get. I will fucking do it. <laughs> Don't tempt this man. He will. <laughs> You saw what happens during Yakuza and how much he's willing to shell out to make me suffer. Hey, TBG, guess what I'm doing on Friday? What? Hope you'll be happy with that $30 bill. Three hours of the shoes. No! That'll be the entire night! Yeah, I'm gonna get, yeah. I'm thinking for three hours, bud. I'm, I'm begging you, Dragon, please don't. It's bad enough it I had now. to make that in- Aww. I felt obliged to turn that into an alert, but now I have to suffer through three hours straight of it! I will mute the stream at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I'll, I'll do the standard in one hour. Yakuza made me suffer enough it, to the point that I almost lost my voice last week! <laughs> okay, that was on you for doing the voice. I, I was obliged to do it, and then the game pulled the rug out from under my feet. Did those feet go mew? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, I will yeah. give you a little hint as to something I'm doing for the Friday Night Funk and Sprite mod. I am going to need Tamu to send me that reference image she had done for her. Which one? Mm. The one of herself. Okay. And another hint. I am also going to need a reference image of Frogger from Frogger's Great Adventure. No! <laughs> Not tell you where it's showing up, but it's going to be in there. Hold on. Okay. Said, hold on, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. Are we checking Discord or something? Oh god damn it! God <laughs> fucking damn it! Thank you though. That's the perfect reference image. He's always watching Dragon. Yeah, I, I swear, if you overlay him on the stream, I can't. That's that's for the composite uh, uh, channel. You can always add him. I mean, he's an alert, so if people drop bits, then yeah, you might see him. How high of how high of bits is he? Uh, about the usual for like the random ones, so a hundred bits. Anything less than that's the green rupee. Oh man, this place has a cafe. My high school's library on the top floor had a cafe. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's bugging me of who this guy looks like. Oh, wait! I He kind of looks like uh, the blonde uh, guy from Ninjala. That's what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Just more anime. Let's see if I get him. Oh, no. You got soccer. Oh. <laughs> well then. <laughs> why was that? Why was that a chest? Listen, soccer can show up at the least likely of places. I mean, it showed up in Ninjala. Huh. Exactly. <laughs> Which I sadly forgot to try that out. <laughs> Don't worry, I kept forgetting to try it out too. <laughs> Look at the size of those hot dogs! Holy hell! Or is that a hokey? TBG, I think it was just, like, really different. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you're right, those burgers are also pretty big. And look at the, What are those, fries? What, what is that? Uh, I think that's supposed to be... something. I'm just being reminded of work, and that's making me sad right now, considering how busy uh, today was. Uh, Look like fries, maybe a thing of hash browns or onion rings. 
I will. I, giant hot dogs. Can I say this? They're... I hate making onion rings at work. They always burn my fingers. Well, here's an idea. Don't put your fingers into the oil. <laughs> I don't. I pick them up and they get them into the container and they burn my fingers. This guy is ready for war. Holy shit. Hmm? Colonel, I'm in an anime. Colonel, I become an anime. What should I do now? This is Raiden's gig. <laughs> God, it does look like a young solid snake here. I was gonna say it looks like snake. Here, let me teach you the basics of CQC. Colonel, am I kawaii? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> wow, that sounded like you just punched the moon right in the gut. <laughs> You good? Ow. Moon, what'd you do? Face palm. <laughs> Colonel, am I kawaii kawaii desu enough Stop for it! you? <laughs> <laughs> Colonel, I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dummy thick and the clap of my ass cheeks keep alerting the acrid. <laughs> Nani? Nani? Goodbye. <laughs> oh, God damn it! There she goes. Oh, and she's gone. <laughs> it's official. We killed Moon with anime. <laughs> well, I got something. Okay, so let's see. Shirt. Oh. Wrong button. Let's see this and then That actually looks better. A white suit with a striped tie is not a good combo. I'm sorry, did you say nerd? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> now give me this. Alright, so I got my uh, new glasses okay, yesterday, but I think I have a bit of an issue now regarding my Oculus. Oh yeah, what's that? I don't think my glasses are going to fit in it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is this icon? It's a Smash Bros. icon. Oh, there we go. ED in second. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Open it. Okay. Speaking of Snake, who I do you, who do you think who do you think would be an unorthodox character for Snake to be friends with in Smash Bros? Unorthodox? Yeah, unorthodox. Like someone you would not expect him to be friends with. Pyra. I can see it, but then again, Pyra's pretty much friendly to everyone from what I, from what I've seen. Okay, fine, Mithra. Fair. L2. Oh, oh, now we got, now we got something. Uh, have you ever seen, you've seen some of the, uh, the achievement images for Smash Bros, right? Yes. Have you seen the one where Snake's holding, it looks like he's holding a tiny Rob? No. Oh my god, someone, uh, someone made a tweet about that with the image thing. Uh, Colonel, tiny robot. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Got a text. From, uh, Wizzy. Oh, you. Do you even know where you're supposed to be going right now? Nope. <laughs> well, this guy's going somewhere, so I'm just gonna follow him. We could be, we're gonna be the best of friends. I can't wait for my best friend to die a tra tragic death. Anime. That's how it usually goes <laughs> in anime. That or something's gonna happen and he's gonna become the unsung hero. Moon, why did you go to an uwu voice? Don't make me do it because I will do it. Do it. Do it. Embrace the anime. Uwu. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, oh my fucking god. 
<laughs> uh, you, she should have done the voice TV as soon as this character. No, <laughs> she should have done it when the character made her introduction. Oh my fucking god. <gasps> I'm in love. I like this guy. Boys, stop thinking of your dicks and think, think of your brains. <laughs> what? <laughs> the, 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 the guy in charge, the guy, the, the guy crosses arms. That's the vibe he gave off me when he was getting onto them about looking at the girl. Ah, <laughs> oh, cool, we got a gun. Shooty, shooty, yeah. bang, bang. This guy looks like he'd be from uh. a, a Final Fantasy game. Kind of does like Final Fantasy VII or something like that. Yeah, he looks like he'd be kind of related to Sid. This is actually a Lost Planet Sid. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, let's see what do we got. Wonder why. All right, so we got the the really weird looking uh, rifle that we started the game with. That, that I will always forever call the Battalion Wars rifle. Mm -hmm. And the flamethrower. Cool. Oh, all right. We got player. We got guest. And we got not Sid as our guest. Oh, yeah. I was, uh... The first picture I started out from Italian Wars tonight, it was the one where you're taking out the eight heavy tanks. Yes. And uh, by the end of it, I was just left with a light tank and a grunt. <laughs> Uh... <laughs> and I somehow At least one won. Boy survived. I have no idea what the At fuck. One... I don't know what happened to my rest of my troops. There were some rifles, but there were some uh, other grunts and some flame vets around. But I sent the other grunts in. If you, yeah, I just sent the grunts after them. Think, okay, they can take her. That's... I look and I see uh, even yeah, the, send the grunts after the flamethrower. I see even the bazooka vets are down. Like, what the fuck happened? <laughs> Gunship? Probably gunship. No, I took down the gunship before heading up. Like, if you if you watch my VOD TPG, you can see I was just kind of a mess in Battalion Wars tonight, even more so than last <laughs> uh. time. Alright, so, yeah, thermal energy is still health in this game. It's just that it doesn't slowly tick down as you play. It's just straight-up health pickups. That running animation is so hokey. Mm -hmm. Very slow. <laughs> I'm gonna run. <laughs> I'm gonna get ya. <laughs> I'm gonna get ya. Trips. To be fair, he would be the kind of guy who just trips all over the place. Definitely. So my current calendar has sloths on it, and the current one for April looks like he wants a high five. Hmm. I just have a regular paper calendar. No one Roadhouse. Knows. Wow, how boring, Moon. I know. I'm a boring bish. <laughs> <laughs> She said it, not us. I mean, she could twist it to say it was us that said it. <laughs> no, nope, she said it. Don't, don't make me do the <laughs> thing again, because I will do it. Do it. You wouldn't dare. <laughs> <laughs> Moon, I fucking triple dog dare you. Make TVG suffer. <laughs> nope. <laughs> You can't triple dog dare me, because guess what? It's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> and out of nowhere. It's not going to happen, my right. ass. <laughs> you got to do it when he least expects it. I'm just going to fly over here and fly into this wall. <laughs> hate you. Ooh. <laughs> 
I'm Sawi TBG. Is this annoying you? <laughs> Wait, where's the ban button? <laughs> oh god, no. <laughs> Hey, let me let me get my band hammer real quick. Are you going to hit me with the band hammer, TBG? Ow! Ow! Ouch! That hurt. <laughs> ow! Wow! 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 <laughs> hate you. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll get my revenge when you least expect it. Oh, will we? Scared. Here, Big scary with TBG. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna just. I don't know what, and I, if I feel like if I say what I'm gonna say, I'm gonna get banned off Twitch. <laughs> the hammer will have turned. <laughs> I'm pushing it, aren't I? <laughs> you put, you pushed it about twelve lines ago. It did where you draw the line the sand, man. <laughs> oh my god, stop. Hey, hey Dragon, how, how'd fighting the Exylvanians go for you? <laughs> Very bad. <laughs> they say it went too well. I'm not gonna deny I was dog shit. <laughs> Good, so we're gonna be doing the race as soon as you finish the game for the first time. No. Yes. Uh, cool, I got blueprints to something. Cool, I can make guns now. You know you can race me? You can race me in Mario Kart. <laughs> uh, sure, I'll make whatever the hell this thing is. <laughs> uh, it's just another boomstick, and it go bang bang. There we go, we turned this piece of paper into a gun. I would not want that thing come frickin' at me. Why does it have such a big pointy thing on the end of it? I, I think it might be a grenade launcher. Uh, and that's like, the, the pointy thing's supposed to like measure the distance of where you lob the grenades. You, you ever see those, uh... Robots are kind of like modeled after dogs. Yes. Yeah, the, the little yellow ones. Yes. Apparently, there were people who were afraid of them, so they so they kicked the shit out of them. They saw them on the streets. Aww. But, Aww. but it's like they're there to literally just map out the roads for construction workers. No, they're here. They're there to uprise. <laughs> Which. Little do people know, if they keep kicking the shit out of them, they are going to. Mm-hmm. It's like, literally, I saw a video of some people, like, found one out in the wild doing its job. The the robot, it actually saw them, and it waved to them real quick. <laughs> Robot's like, hi! Yeah, they were, they were super psyched about it, like, holy shit! And did they kick it over? No, they were in a car, and they were, like, just in awe of it. <laughs> oh. I thought it was like it was waving to them high and then they, they kicked it. No. And pretty sure I'm pretty sure the count. whole internet would have condemned them if they showed that. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> That, that that's actually a pretty good splash page. I think I might make that the thumbnail for the vod whenever th this goes up. Oh, but that one's also good. Ha! Ah! I think for Battalion Wars, I think that might be the first VOD series I actually upload to YouTube. I will have to like put a disclaimer for the first part though because uh. The stuttering and the audio issue. Yeah, speaking of audio issues, I'm still working on getting that link to the past VOD up. I think I might know a way so I don't have to keep uh, reworking the audio, but uh, I'm not 100% sure if it's going to work or not. Is the same thing I'll that happened to the, the Frogger VOD? Where the audio got a bit desynced at times? Yeah. 
Yes. What causes that? It's super weird. I have no idea. I think it might have been when the stream kind of borked itself a little bit. Because mm. it was fine until, like, the everything got all crunchy, and then that's when it kind of went to hell. Okay, now, okay, I'm thinking about it. I should probably download my two Battalion Wars mods real quick. The, the, the face I make when that when the audio was desynced. I just noticed that their mouths don't move. <laughs> Alright, well, we got a friend. Uh, it depends on where it is. Like, Yakuza does that sometimes, where their mouths don't move when they talk. <clears throat> for some cutscenes. It just depends on, like, the, the quality. Because sometimes they'll upscale things to be, like, fully fluid and animated. Mm. But if it's, like, still images and they won't talk. Or if it's, like, just field models. TBG, how do I download VODs? Uh, you go to your content on your dashboard and then uh, uh, click download VOD. So what kind of secret do you think that guy's hiding under those glasses? Dark. <laughs> dark secrets. You think they're... You think they're... Nice long lashes? Oh, so uh, beautiful and flowing. Sure. Whatever that is. Alright, let's go. Because that's pretty much how it works in anime concept, is when the guys hide in their eyes, they're hiding their girly eye. <laughs> <laughs> and it's usually a bald guy. Alright. Uh, how long have we been at Lost Planet? Probably an hour. All right, I think after this mission we'll probably uh, swap games then. <clears throat> is that supposed to be a data post? Oh, yes, it is. Roadhouse. <laughs> Roadhouse. <laughs> yep, it's a data post. That'd be why you have your little nerd friend with you. Oh, I see. That's the energy blaster because I remember uh, seeing the projectiles that he shoots. Well, it takes a while for uh, a bot to get prepared to download. Yeah, de it depends on how uh, long the stream is. Oh god, it's it's grenade guy. Mine was almost two hours for the first night. I'm just the cocky pink hair guy. I'm sorry, sorry I killed a bunch of the boys tonight, but I have to do this even more though. No. Roadhouse. Can you kick him off the edge? I don't think so. I think there's an invisible wall there to keep you from doing it. Cool, I got a m microchip. <clears throat> what flavor is that? Crunchy. Uh, blueberry favored. <laughs> Yo, blueberry chips. Oh no, he's back! For round two! We'll give him some of his road house. <laughs> Uppercut! Kick! 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 Road house! Colonel, I just got kicked in the face. What do I do? Snake, you have to stop getting kicked in the face. Remember the basics of CQC. Oh my god. <laughs> See, like this kid got it down pat more than I do.
No, come on, I got a sneak. You guys oh, use a gun. Oh, they keep coming out of these spawners. I have to capture the data post. Ah! Who? What? You. Man, I'm so glad I figured out what that issue was. So let me real quick like, send you what I was using before to record my Wii. Alright. Uh oh. Oh, not good. Still loading. Ah. Oh wow! If you uh, boost and then do a melee attack, it takes off a lot of health from these guys. No, oh, there we and go. I sent it to you. All right, I'll check it out once we're done. Well, not level three. Woo! Uh, we got a thing. <laughs> and we got a bunch of other things. There we go, now it's downloading. First star shooting star. All one word, by the way. Oh, yeah, did you send you use Pinnacle as your editing software? <clears throat> yes. Is that free or do I have to buy it? Uh, there's a version of it that's free, but for everything, you have to buy it. Uh, how much does that typically cost? Uh, it depends on what version you want. It can go from, I think, either 20 to $80. Uh, what, what does each version come with, if you remember? What? what? Uh, I don't remember exactly. They have, like, a thing on the website, uh, that tells you what each version has in it. Alright, let me look this up real quick. What's the moon? <laughs> I'm just watching the comic thing. <laughs> God, his mouth is so big in this panel. Actually, his mouth has been like huge in all these panels. What are you saying, DBG? <laughs> that, that he's a loud mouth? <laughs> oh, so you got something in common. <laughs> You walked right into that. Hey. <laughs> All right. Well, this has been fun, actually. Uh, I might uh turn this into a game clearing game at some point in the future. <clears throat> If only now the question you know would what be, I said. do. <laughs> uh, you can still kind of follow along. <clears throat> so, uh, here's the thing. If I do turn this into a game clearing, would we start from the beginning again, or should we just continue from where we left off? I say continue from where you left off. Yeah. All right, yeah. Okay, so the most. Yeah, I will say. The, so, the studio game opening. is actually pretty long at the beginning. I think I'm gonna because I just got my paycheck, so I'm probably gonna go Studio Ultimate here, which is $109. All right, all right, all right. For now, though, it is time for us to go to intermission. All right. <clears throat> so game three that I want to look up uh, and t try out is a game that a lot of people said that is really fun but also really difficult and also incredibly weird. So for the next game we're going to look at after this break, we are going to take a look at Golden Light on the Steam. Hmm. So I'm going to go get that set up, also get some water because I really need it. And when we get back, we shall take a look at that. Mm -hmm.
Okay. What are you doing? I am playing a phone game. You got games on your phone? Mm-hmm. Just a decorating game. Nothing else. It's just a white game? A decorating game. Ah. Do you, ever, do you ever have one of the first, like, iPod Touches? No. I don't. Oh, wait. Me and my... Yes. Sorry. <laughs> did you ever have those just, like, plethora of just cake baking and decorating games? No. <laughs> Me and my sister had, like, we had ones for cakes, pancakes, donuts. Oh, my God. I still have my old iPod Touch, iPod Touch actually. It, it's the first one that was with a camera. Yeah, my um, one of my friends used to have one of those. And yeah, I haven't seen her since. <laughs> Got eight gigabytes. It has like it has the fat charging port. It's a fat charging port. You know, you know how uh, most Apple products have like the tiny one now. Mhm. Mm they used to have like a really wide one. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. The wide charging ports. Oh, yeah. This thing still works. I should probably charge it and see if I can turn it on. I just use my phone for everything now. <laughs> Same here, but I'm, I'm curious to see how well this thing is holding up. Oh, my God. Hold on. This thing is tiny compared to my phone. <laughs> like, holy shit! It's so small. Oh god, I wish I had a way to take, uh, take a picture of this, actually. <laughs> Mine is my my phone is the Samsung Galaxy S10. Mine's the S Note 10, I think. I want a note so bad. Uh, you can do gestures in the air with the pen if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Unfortunately, I'm trying to get a new car, so saving up for a car is a little more important than... I don't have a car, car, mainly dude, because I don't know how to drive, and I'm terrified to. I kind of need a car to get to work, so... <laughs> I'm lucky enough that I, that I have, uh, my parents are... My dad's able to drive me every day, and it's not mm -hmm. too far away. But, like, eventually I, I really do need to learn how to drive. It's not as bad as you think it is. Once you get Try a hang of it, because I used okay. to, I used to be terrified of driving. Trust me. <laughs> my my freaking mom. I get nervous in the car easily when I'm driving, and she thinks it's a good idea to yell at me. Uh, that's why. Yeah, so it's like. Ah. <laughs> Stop yelling at me, mom. I'm trying. I, I tell her that, but she doesn't stop. You need to have, like, your dad or something go with you. No, no, no. My dad's way better than, at teaching me than my mom. But just funny considering he can get bad road rage. Yeah. No, I went with my dad because I knew my mom would be like, Break! 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 <laughs> Yeah, my mom. My mom's the same way. And my aunt, she's uh, she taught my mom how to drive, so she would be like, "Oh no, 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 no." <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hey, Never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Tamo. Oh, Tamo's in here. Tamo. <clears throat> Hello, Tamo. All right. Uh, 
I'm actually really happy Tamo should have because this was actually a game I talked with her about uh, a while ago. Uh, so, Golden Light. <clears throat> a really weird game. Very meaty. Ow. I need to turn that volume down. <laughs> she said, oh no. Oh yes. Settings. I need to readjust this thing so it's not my best with my wrist. So waz, then spring left shift, dash space, crouch left control. It's, it's like crouch to C. Interact with E, attack left button, right button, switch weapon, closer Q, and G. drop vitamins G. Oh god! Oh god! What is going on? What Sorry. is Calm down. going on? I'm not seeing right now because I am getting the editing software set up. There we go. Here, you know what? Uh, I'll open the call to Tamo as well. If she would like to join us in, in the meaty fun. Oh yeah, Tamo. Uh, before I forget, I'm gonna need you to send me that. Uh, that ref the character reference sheet you had yourself done before. I'm gonna need a reference. I'm gonna need that for something. Meat Garden, you do not want to spend uh you don't want to spend a lot of time learning the game, no achievements, meat war you love to win even through pain. Meat so true horror roguelike experience. Are we going are we going to a garden or are we going to a war? I have a feeling I might have to look away from it. <laughs> Since this is just a uh, looking at the game, I might as well go through the, the setting just so I can get a handle on everything. Oh, epilepsy warning. Hand! Jesus Christ. Everything has like a, a weird like outline to it. It's so shaded, but not. It's pixel art, but not. <laughs> the sun never sets, silly. The sun shines on Earth all the time, even when it's hidden behind the horizon. So, the day and the night are bound together forever. They cannot be without each other. Is this a remake of a Dream oh, LSD simulator? <laughs> Maybe. To be together forever, yet always it hurts. We haven't gone out together for so long, my love. We haven't gone out together for so long, my love. We haven't gone out together for so long, my love. We haven't gone out together for so long. We haven't gone out together for so long. I get it. We haven't gone out together for so long. Don't mind me. I'm just going to walk off into the distance. You'll never see me again. Okay, Moon, I think I got a good size comparison for uh, my old iPod Touch. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's compare that to my Switch. Oh wow, this does go on forever. Tiny, basically. <laughs> Miniscule. I have a flower. So long. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> meat. Welcome to the meat zone. It's like they try to do pixel art in a 3D environment. It's super trippy to look at. Uh, very. Oh, oh. Ah! What is it, my love? Uh, what it the took fuck? Me away. <laughs> it dragged me to its grave. There you go. It put me under hundreds of locks. Will I ever see you again? Here in the depths of uh, the flowers of blood? 
It holds me with its red hot fangs. It says it just can't stop. But I'm still waiting for you. Here in the depths of the flowers and blood. This is the oh. weirdest one night stand I've ever seen. Uh, tab. Tab? I have nothing. Memento. Notes. Weapons can live. They are all different. Living weapons have a random effect. When attacking, talking weapon has its effect on the enemy and on you. Dead weapons are weaker. Some weapons can heal you on attack. Press H to attack yourself. Poison doesn't kill. Rust uh, wears weapon more with every attack. If you catch fire, run. Uh, it, way it'll burn faster. Heal somehow to stop bleeding. Uh, gold hunger eats away at your gold over time. If you have no gold, it eats you. Pick up more gold to reduce the effect. Bone shiver it's, is a bummer. If you don't run, you freeze to death. Love drives you crazy. You can't fight. Uh, when blood burns, you are strong. Your blood is boiling. With rusty poison, you are more endurant. Run. Love and gold will strengthen your health, sweetheart. Meat garden, no achievements, all that stuff. Save her. Jump into the hole in which she disappeared. So far, I have found only her double made of cold stone in which there is no light at all. So, I... Uh, okay. So, I just... Oh, I found some gold. Uh, oh, 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 God, Th that is weird. Gold, gold. I write this with two fingers that I have left to, to whoever reads this. The weapon will not help, just run away. Meat hold. The meat hold exudes heat. Shove, her ha shove your hand into the meat hold. Grab that meat, TBG. I grabbed something. I didn't see what it was because it went. Oh, I think it was a pistol bullet. Okay, that's the paper. I, I feel like I feel like this is the game where Moon just like nopes out. I with fingers. Got an eye with fingers. I carry two items. It makes me normal. Yeah. What the fuck is that also, thing? Uh, the gut is a strange place. The walls here are constantly shifting. The items are changing. Yesterday I ate a fish head and it healed me. Today I ate another one and it poisoned me. Uh, that this is the map. What? Ow! And I just smacked myself in the face with the map. Okay, so the map is a weapon. <laughs> Why does the map have eyes? Why, what, your map doesn't have ice? Tamo, is that you? Yeah. Maybe. Hi, Tamo. Alright, what was... Let's see. Attack game, switch weapon, hold to holster Q. Drop item, hold G. Reload R. Switch weapon... Oh, I see. I also have, I somehow picked up a bad head. Eat it. How do I... Let's see, what was it? Crouch, interaction, E, attack. I need a moment. <laughs> Help me. E, F. Well, I just ate the map. What? I, I ate Red Johnny. What? Uh, okay, what do I do for items? Attack yourself, throw item, or throw T. Tamo, if you're talking, we can't hear you. <clears throat> I, I can hear Tamo. Can you, Dragon? Mm -hmm. What? I slammed the door. It started to bleed. The explosion exploded. I jumped over the, the hands. I broke a weapon after hitting a fatty. I opened the door. I was scared. Curtains Wait, up. no, I'm it's listening to the stream. Scary. You guys can't fucking fool me. I might have to, hold on, let me see if I can turn Tama's voice up a little bit. I'm talking a bit softly because my door is open a little bit to keep it cool in here. 
Uh, oh yeah, it's fucking yeah. hot lately. Oh, it's only supposed to get hotter. The sad part is we skipped. It seems like we skipped the winter. Speak for yourself. It's it's been crazy this week. I'm talking me. about where I'm at. Over here, just yeah. it felt like summer part two, the revengeing. <laughs> Summer too. Well, you do live on the surface of Mars. So. I do not. Surface of Mars, Arizona. Same hey, ASMR, thing. ASMR. No, no, I think you're thinking Australia because that's the place with the alien and dangerous life forms. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Attack, aim, swap weapon, reload, switch item, eat item, hold to eat weapon. Oh, okay. So press F. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. That's really yeah, getting hot. I'm on fire. Woo. Really getting high in here, I guess. Yeah. Speaking of summer, you're on fire. My guys are leaving my computer running overnight so Pinnacle can download. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine. I do it. Like, the mentos all the time. give you new powers or new problems. Well, keep in mind, I I do everything off a laptop. No, not the meat hole. Shove my hand into the meat hole. Grab yes. it. I found some gold. Oh, the meat exploded. Meat hole digs secret passages throughout the gut. Sometimes he grabs you and drag. Oh. Ugh. Apples. What is fucking going on? I am tripping. Okay, so do we do we get mole uh, that'll dig secret passages, but sometimes it'll randomly throw me to a different part of the level, or no? no. Or this other thing you do not remember. Hmm. Oh, Jesus Christ, two bots. Really? I got him. But Jesus, um, there's another one. Jesus Christ. Yeah, they've been on the rampage lately. They hear you. Ah! I got this what one. What is going on? I know a few other streamers that have uh, gotten a lot of bots during the stream. Yeah, that's the key. Christ! I guess because I hear breathing, that is a monster. Oh, Jesus! Dude! Jesus, holy shit! What the fuck? Okay, there's one, two... You're gonna be asking that a lot. Three, four, five bots in the span of a minute. I can open the elevator now. Boo! <laughs> In absolute meat, I'm inside your flesh. A wheel is going its way. I'm dying for you. X. The one who has a head hears your steps and sh uh, shots. What? So, Tamil, I'm guessing from what TVG said earlier, you know a bit about Ah, this shit, game. hold on, hold on. I hear breathing. What was that, Dragon? Uh, you know about, about this, a bit about this game from what TVG was saying earlier? Just throw weapon, throw weapon was I wanted to forget about this game. What is this game? Oh, God. It's a game I about meat. To... I know it's a roguelike. Oh, hey, actually, this helped. Everything is meat, including the weapons, Everything. especially the weapons. Even the cheese. Cheesy. Even the meat is meat, especially the meat. God, I gotta change the station. Damn, I forgot how old I am. I wake up dead tired. Goddamn smoke everywhere. Cottonhead. What's new in general? Ah! Alright, 
right, floor one. You hit quietly, just go right through. Don't hit fatty, jump and run if you're on fire. What? I, 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 uh, 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 oh, I got a key. I'm not going to have to download Isaac onto my Switch to counteract a weird a roguelike with a at least a normal one by today's standards. Like, I have no words. It was like Binding of Isaac, it's weird, but like, it, you can understand its weirdness. What's not to understand here? Yeah. Don't don't you know about meat? Guy's girlfriend called her I gets kidnapped meat. by the meat dimension, and you go in to save her from the meat dimension. And I don't be fucking thinking about this game, bro. When I'm making when I'm grilling the burgers. Ooh. Need a hand, TBG. Map at least. No. Get a little handsy. Let's see, where am I? I'm right here. And there's a bunch of stuff. Can you there, attack so the map? Just... Yes, I can. <laughs> I don't want to kill the map. You slashed a map. So this just loots me back around to where I first started. This game is making me contemplate my life choices in life. I don't know why. Oh! <coughs> there is a party going on in there! I stuck in- Ah! Gee! Ah! Fucking mole! Where am I? Yoink! I'm in a bathroom. Um. I stuck nails into his eyes, I opened the door, blood filled my dress, I jumped over the hands, <sighs> I pulled out my eye, Mimic jumped on me, blood flooded did my dress. Okay then. Oh, well, thankfully it pulled me to a place where there's a map right behind me. Get it. Heck oh. No, don't hit Oh, oh, okay, uh, the vending machine is trying to kill me. It's not all that's trying to kill her. Eat this game! I saw, I saw that bookcase. Yay. Oh god! This is like demented prop hunts. Except in reverse. Yeah, the I don't props know if my dad sees this game. Yeah, that's kind of mm -hmm. drugs for me on. But that's a legitimate question this time about. I think the developers of this were Finnish. Uh, Russian. That makes things so much worse. I want to be Russian out of here. Well, we only have two keys. We need one more. Bano, Slavic developers tend to ah! uh, make them very weird things. Mm -hmm. That, uh, Moon, you might want to look away. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> A snack. I got a meat face. My speed is oh, normal. Blood again? There are so many things Shotgun! Hello, shotgun! Got shot. Yay! A shotgun jumped into my hands. Hey, hold a shotgun! What the. Something just pokoed itself right out of this room. Would you rather poke its way over to you? My brain, it hurts. Mine too. Oh god! What the? Uh, well, I I slashed Mr. Blade. Apparently there was there was a land shark uh, swimming its way right after me. And I just saw a footstool just jump over a potted plant. You know, if you want another, if you want another weird bit, like look at Juice Galaxy. Juice Galaxy? Yes. 
My, my boyfriend oh, showed God, me it through one of Vine Sauce's uh, stream vods, and it was the weirdest shit I've ever seen. Oh, I'm going to die if I do not be care get careful. Need your axe. It's got abilities, though. Oh, because oh. where does it say durability? Um, the axe was looking really red. Oh, it wasn't before. Fine, I'll, I'll just stick with shotgun then. Memento. Secret burn. Your skin is decorated with the scars and burns of a childhood. You are used to pain, so you absorb a par some part of it. Yes, please. You want you want to know something, Dragon? This game has co-op. What? Yes. Hello. Anyway, how is so, my uh, what do you how how is my lacking or my description lacking? You're in the meat dimension. There are meat things here. That's about it. My brain was fried enough today from work, and this is just, not helping. Just think of the weird enemies as mimics from Dungeons and Dragons, and you'll be fine. Yeah, apparently, like most of the enemies, like that are like the 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 meat things coming after me, are all mimics. Aside from some of them, I ew ew. <laughs> Slimy leech. Snail head inflicts regeneration. The face of a psychopath inside of a shell. Don't break your teeth. May bite your tongue. Eat it, and your wounds will heal over time. If you throw it, flowers will sprout, but they will not stay for a long time. Yeah, me too, Moon. Me too. What is Moon saying? I can't see. Dots. Just dots. Oh. Okay, where are you, sneaky little shit? I'm here, I just... Oh, what the fuck can you say about words. this game? I have no words. I like to tip off this game. Hey. Like, why are you putting this top on Halloween? Fair. What did you say, Tamo? Sorry. I said, why are you playing this game not on Halloween? Because I wanted to look at it, and this game is weird enough that I want to do a co-op run of it on Halloween. I thought we were going to be there. Do, uh, <laughs> I thought we were going to make plans to do Luigi's Mansion 3 Scarescraper. We can we can do multiple things. Oh. Meat, Meat Blade. Meat Blade dies. I mean, October is 31 days long. Man dead, big brawler dead. So, can you eat the leech? Uh, yes, do uh, it. What was the button to eat weapons? Uh, eat item, hold, hold to eat weapon. Mm. I'm all rusty now and rusted. Uh, where wep uh, where's weapons more with every attack? Yeah, uh, damn it. Hmm. Did you break your axe? No, but my axe is definitely gonna be more rusted now. There you are. Oh, and I just saw another game we could do for uh, October that's multiplayer. Deceit. It's free on Steam. Is that the, the game where you play as a cult? No. Uh, no. Oh no, wait, that was like Devour or something like yes, that? Yes, that's Devour. You know, game Mind Wish had a co op mode. See, is, think of it as a much more scary Among Us and it's in first person. Uh, I don't know, Among Us is already scary enough as is. Spooky well, two, two players are monsters and they run around trying to kill everyone while staying hidden. And they have to, like, drink. Shotgun! They have to drink blood bags without getting caught so they can uh, go into their monster form quicker. Oh yeah, that was Among Us before Among Us. When did this see come out? Because Among Us came out like, what, two, two or three years ago? Yeah, that game's been around so. longer.
Deceit came out March 3rd, 2007. Or 2000, 2017. Ooh, Revolver. Uh, Among Us was released in 2018. Okay, so they were a year apart. I'll leave the shotgun there. I'll come back to it later. It's enough to honestly be a bit of a coincidence. Yeah. Because th I think Among Us was in development for a good bit. Although it's so simple that they might have taken some inspiration. There you are. Although it's more likely to take inspiration from. Well, no, the I, th thing. I think Among Us was inspired by uh, board games like Secret Hitler. I don't want to hear thing. that fucking name of that game ever again. What the heck is going on? Why is it all sparkly? Because this game is magical, TBG. This game is something, although magical, I don't... I don't think would be the right word for it. What the fuck okay. was that noise? What fuck was that? I don't know, that's why I'm getting my shotgun. Alright, who's moving? Oh, Move sorry, on. that's my stomach. Also, I don't know oh. what time it is. Uh, oh, it's friendly? <sighs> Sup, bro, have you seen them yet? Uh. Well, them, duh. We share a bed with them. None of all their hugs are sweet, but some, oh yes. So you need help, spare coin man? Grab the 80 golden key. Into its flesh. Okay, I need an adult. Going on, on the other side of this wall. He is an adult. <laughs> I think at least. <laughs> stupid hand. I think the mole wants you to leave. Well, I need another key. I can't leave without three keys. Uh, and this is where I say, hey, I gotta go to bed because I got work in the morning. No, you stay here, coward. No, like, I legitimately need to get to bed. It's gamely here. Alright. Alright. Night, guys. Night. 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 Good night. Sweet dreams of thinking about what you just saw. I'll play Bisic, Binding of Isaac to counteract this for a Bisic. <laughs> Bisic of Einding. He's already gone. Einding of Bisic. Alright, so should I rub the meat into hugs or not? You mean the cold I, don't know. Hugs. I, 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 I don't even know what to say. Oh! Yeah, the flesh. Something. Something just came out of that wall to try and take my head off. I like your shotgun's kind of dirty, man. Yeah, I see it. Alright, uh... Alright, down that hallway. Alright, I think that was just hugs. I just really, really wanted a hug. A pipe. Uh, you know what? Hmm. What was eat weapon? Uh, drop weapon, hold drop weapon, eat item, hold eat weapon. Nice. And now you have a plank. Something is going on, but I don't know what. Oh, got a leech. Well, don't eat it. Uh, throw weapon was... <laughs> oh. Saw 
something. I was gonna say yeet the leech. Uh, I'll yeet it when I... Oh! Guess what? We had all the keys this entire time! <laughs> You're special to me. His silence says no. You are a wet dog. <laughs> I'm a wet, ha ha ha. <laughs> Turns out we're lost. Ha ha ha. But yeah, the girl Your mustache is all shady. wet. Why is the rain look like it's made of molten ivory? Because it is. When you go to the rain, it's like made of meat. Oh! Stop killing everything. Eat weapons, they hear you. Don't hit fatty. Alright, three keys. At least this one actually has a little bit more light in it. <coughs> you say you're oh. under a dark and spooky corridor. stuff again. I don't think the sparkling stuff is good. Ooh, pistol. Uh, mm, pistol or shotgun? I don't use the shotgun until it is used, it is used up all of its usefulness. Ah, ow! I meant to jump backwards. I don't think you saw it, but I I, I sipped at some souls. I saw it. The hell? I'm not your joy. Oh, it's she. You promised me. My parts are left to be eaten by wandering hungry meat. It was so long ago. I cannot breathe, my love. I hear your footsteps. Yes! You don't come for me. I miss your lips so much. Ch kiss her? That was a mistake! That was a mistake! Hun, it's not you, it's me, but I don't think this is working out, so... Yeah. Oh, that was a weird shit. She made she made too much sense to be she. I, oh god! Of all the places worth to throw me! Oh what what the fuck am I? Where am I? What is this? So welcome to computer huh? Grenade. Nice. Ow! I have acquired a meat apple. And an eye with fingers. Oh no. Hmm. 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 How could this happen? It's getting a little dangerously close. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about you, but I seem to be in quite a predicament! You think? Things said to, like, jump and run when you're on fire. Oh, hey, I got a key. Well, whatever I did, it killed a lot of things. That that is that is this is a room of meat. Oh, well, it's probably not just a grenade. It's probably a Molotov. 
Maybe. Well, there was something, there was another mimic that walked right past. I don't know where he disappeared to. I've got a leech. Another <gasps> leech. Remember, with every item you have, the slower you get. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna start throwing some things or drop them. Let's see. G. What was. Uh. What does. Pan uh. Panakia do, do again? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure that's a good thing. Right. <laughs> probably look at the tab real quick. Let's see. Gold hunger, so the fire bleeding, gold hunger, bone shiver. Well, I think maybe that's love. Get the mole. Just gonna drop the leech. Yeah, yeah it's spit. <sighs> Something happened. Oh, I think I just pissed everything off. Alright, uh, get the ball, get the ball. Yeah, uh, I can't believe it has you in this point. Oh god. Oh god. That's great. In an effort to not hurt my own voice, I can't hear the sounds it's making. Uh, crap, I went in a circle. Oh no, everything's coming after me. I have pissed everything off. You think? I know. Thankfully, I don't have a shotgun. Everything is. Uh, I'm sorry if I keep throwing this up. I just need to remember everything. Especially. Ah, oh, no, not not this room again. Oh God, that's not it. I 
think that's what we're going to call it here for Golden Light. I, I don't know what that big red pulsating thing up there is, and quite frankly, I don't want to know. Oh, why not, TBG? <laughs> because we've been at this for almost an hour now. So, uh, sh should we do the other floor, or should we call it here? I'm going to leave it up to you two. Uh, I really can't answer it for you, because I'm just... Yeah. Too weirded out. I'm too weirded out. Tamo? Did Tamo say she had to step away for a minute? Yeah, she's mute. Oh. Alright. You know what? We'll do one more floor. Oh, gosh. What? What is this? My pizza arrived. Oh. oh god. What is that? Speaking of me. What is that? Arrived. Huh? That is horrifying. <laughs> ah! I feel like I need to put a sensor bar over there, that thing. What? It's just hands. The, the center part is here. That is a lot of hands. They just get handsy and grabby. You can't catch these hands. <laughs> oh, meat hole. Uh, uh, well, now I have got some. I'm now ready to throw hands. Tiny penis alarm. Holy shit, what the hell was that? Uh, someone that thinks he's badass just because he has a motorbike. Damn, that was loud. <laughs> Been dealing with that for months now. Well, guess what? Uh, we're done with this floor. I don't know what the fuck this thing is. Meat. Meat. Okay, that's so <laughs> those silly Russians. The more I look at this, the, the weirder, the more weirded out I get. Uh, well, I got her head. Yay? Question mark? <laughs> you Excuse saved. me. I'm so sorry. Nice. Oh, what the? Uh, uh. <gasps> oh, that's wrong. Oh, that's wrong. <laughs> oh, here. Uh, bike. A meat bicycle. <laughs> I have the shiniest meat bicycle. <laughs> oh, wow, you book it with this thing. Oh, yeah, it's a bicycle. <laughs> Bikes can go pretty fast. Wow, bro, you alive? First time falling out of the gut, huh? Yeah, that sucks. I remember my first time. Well, the good news is, no one can eat you on this field, except for me. <laughs> but the bad news, there is n nothing special to do here unless someone else falls on us. Alright, hop on my seat, by the way. My name is Snout. It's nice to meet you, bro. Uh, it's so hot in here. <laughs> so you're gonna save me in the damsel, huh? Good luck with that. If you climb into the gut with such noble purposes. I dug down here, not entirely for the best of reasons. Uh, it's so hot in here. Alright, well, I'm gonna eat my shotgun, so, uh... How are you holding the shotgun when you have both hands on your handlebars? Uh, with my teeth. Makes sense. Thompson ammo. Oh, these aren't even my arms, by the way. They're just arms sticking out of the thing. Huh. Huh. Weird. That is a big piano. You're a big piano.
okay. Uh, I, I like your piece. I'm just gonna ride my bicycle this way. Have fun doing whatever the hell that is. It's called art, man. You wouldn't get it. Is that what you call it? <sighs> no one understands me. <laughs> this lame up. I will take that. There's something up here. It's a golden tree. Bury half your gold in the roots. The gut loves you again. So did I just make things? Oh, what the? Oh, I jumped. So did I make things easier or harder for me now? No, oh, one way to oh. find out. Picked up a rose. Mm. So I wonder if the further I progress into the game, uh, these like little like roped off sections will open up to me. Possibly. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> Anything can happen in this game. <laughs> Except something not being made of meat. Too fast. Ow. Thank you, it's peaceful here. It ate your stuff. How dare. Oh, wow. Guess what? It almost killed me, too. Also, I have both of them. Damn it. What does that mean? Uh, it's slowly gonna eat away at my gold. What the? Is that a giant lawnmower? Uh, it slowly eats away at my gold, and if I don't have gold, then it slowly starts to kill me. Hmm. I really just don't understand this game whatsoever. I think I've lost brain cells because of this game. I think we just went back into the gut. Uh, nope. We are back in the apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get out of this. What are you afraid of? I will help you. I'm scared for you. I would love that. All you do is work. Yep, we are back in the gut. Alright, <laughs> now I think it's time for us to call it for uh, Golden Light. Mm -hmm. all, all I'll say is, this game is meat. It is meat. That's it. Can we, it is indeed meat. Can we just never play this one again? <laughs> I, I don't know, this might be a good thing to, to play for like Halloween or something. <laughs> <laughs> or uh, hold on a second I need to look something up real quick
Ah, oh, damn it. <clears throat> uh, next time we'll play it is either Halloween or February 9th. <laughs> Why February 9th? Because February 9th is National Meat Day. <laughs> I will not be there. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. You don't, you don't want to see me beat things with meat? You don't want to see him beat his meat? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I was trying to avoid it. <laughs> Oh, I God. gotta make at least one. My brain cells, they're gone. <laughs> All right, l let's do something less meat related. Uh, let's play a game that's on the Wii that I've been wanting to look at for a while now. Let's play some Zack and Wiki. So what? Zack and Wiki, did he stutter? I yeah, <laughs> uh, so Zach and Wiki, uh, I'll, you know what, I'm just going to talk about it when we get to the game. So I will see you all in a bit. Right there? <laughs> yeah, fine. I haven't even begun to cough. <laughs>
I am meat. You are meat. We are all meat. I mean, you're technically meat, so. true. That's technically true. <laughs> we are meat. Oh. Moon is quenching my thirst. <laughs> no! Why is this not showing up? What the hell? Oh, there it goes. Alright. So, Zack and Wiki. Uh, this was a game I remember seeing in Nintendo Power, like, ages ago. Mm -hmm. I need to kill that feedback. There we go. So, th this is going to be definitely a tonal shift for anyone who was watching beforehand, if there's anyone else in the chat. <laughs> and, uh, also people watching the VOD. <laughs> uh, you, you might like this, Moon. Oh? Uh, you would like this if the game disc could be right. I'll be right back. <laughs> Mmm, pizza. <laughs> So, we might have a problem. Mm -hmm. uh, the Wii is refusing to read the game disc. Uh-oh. Which, uh, this sucks. Mm -hmm. You know what doesn't suck? This pizza I made. Oh, holy shit. I just, I was just scrolling up in the chat and I just realized, we got a lot of bots during Golden Light. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm just seeing bot, 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 bot. Yeah. There was a lot. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm going to jump to intermission. I'll try one more time to see if I can figure out why is uh, this not working. So I'll be right back. If not, I do have a fallback plan. Okay.
So, yeah, it doesn't look like Zack and Wiki is going to be playable tonight, unfortunately. Aww. I, I see what the issue is, but it, it's outside my ability to, to fix it. Uh, there is, like, a lot of gunk around, like, the edge of the disc. Mm. And, uh, well, it, it's a pre-owned game, so that's that's why it's not in the best condition. So, I do have a workaround. I do have something we can replace this with. And I also have a friend who could possibly uh, clean and repair the disc for me. Oh, that's... So... So I do actually have to go somewhere, uh, buy a store on Friday, so I'll take the game in and see if he can fix it up. So, unfortunately, we can't play Zack and Wiki tonight. However, I do have a fallback plan. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go to here, go back to the HDMI. And we're gonna change this to the Switch. Uh, where did this stuff go? There it is. I should speedrun Zack and Wiki. I would need to play it first. <laughs> nah. Mo <laughs> most, if not all the games that we have played tonight are completely blind. And I honestly want to put Zack and Wiki on a game clearing uh, list at some point. So maybe make it a game for either J uh, January, or January, June, or sometime in the summer. <laughs> All right, so let's go to the switch. I actually need to throw up intermission real quick because it. Oh nope, there we go. All right. So, a couple days ago, uh, my friend, my mod, my buddy Dragon, he sent me a copy of Tie to Bush Rescue for the Switch, and I've wanted to take a look at it. <laughs> so let me just. This. There we go. All right. So I remember playing this game a long time ago, back in the days when I was but a wee lad. And I remember really liking this, although I kind of like the first tie game a bit more. Uh huh. But this was a, still a pretty solid sequel. All right. Uh, first things first. Let's see. Movie player, concept art. Okay, no. Kart racing. And we'll just go to a new game. Actually, real quick. Sound. Turn the music up just a little bit and sound up as well. Turn the subtitles on. Yeah, right. Head on back. Start a new game. Wait, oh, oh. never mind. Time. Audio sounds like it's still coming from the PS2. What Mark would want to do this? The local security is in the thick of it. One of their mates is holed up at the old barracks. Oh, this is a shocker out there. Frills have breached the Northern River. Sly, Shazza, I'm gonna need your help. <clears throat> you can count on us. If we follow this road, it'll take us up to the old barracks. Okay, let's go. All right. Uh, let's see controls. Uh, why is a bite? That's uh, that's super weird. Hi, mate. What are you doing? All right. Let's see. What else do we have? Uh, X is nothing. Why is throw the boomerangs? Uh, oh god. Oh no. Gyroscopic aiming controls <laughs> are actually kind of pretty responsive, which is impressive because I'm someone who hates gyroscopic controls. 
All right, nothing else with this. Nothing with the. Oh, nope. D pad is control the camera. All right, let's go. Oh, wait. Hold on. Someone wanted to talk. Ah, good. The ice cream truck is here. No, where are you going? Oh, 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 okay, okay. He's go. Oh, and he's now stuck in the, the road. Uh, you okay? What are you doing? I'm trying to rescue this ice cream driver. Wow. Do you not do you not do you not see what has happened to this poor guy? He's teetering on the edge of the abyss. <laughs> aren't, aren't you gonna do something? It looks like the ground no? is trying to slurp it all on all the ice cream. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's go. go. <laughs> Just <laughs> But it's having trouble because the ice cream is so full of carbs, the earth is concerned that it will grow fat. <laughs> oh, right. Bite, bite's usually just good for, like, uh, specific enemies. Just keep throwing rains for normal enemies. Also, uh, uh, yeah, uh, there's a war going on in, uh, Australia. It's not the emo war, is it? No. It's the lizard war. Ah. Uh, I feel like it would have more to do with kangaroos than lizards, but okay. Funny, I was gonna say, I don't think there are kangaroos in this game, but then I remembered, no, they actually were, like, enemies in the first Thai game. Frickin' kangaroos. Picking each other's butts. What? what? Kangaroos. Never mind. I knew there was something wrong with those kangaroos. <laughs> yep, got some. Oh, there's more health back here. <sighs> so. I do appreciate they tried to, to go bigger with this game, like a lot of like big set pieces. Mm -hmm. But I, I don't know. I, there, I remember there was like a point in this game where I just kind of got bored with it, it I guess is the right word to say. <laughs> okay. I think it was like during like the third act of the game. It was like three out of three to four or three to five, but I remember there was just a point where it's just like, eh, this game's starting to kind of drag out a bit. Yeah. Let me at him. Ooh, what? Oh. I'm gonna bite him. Nope. Oh god. Jeez! They really like up the explosions for the HD remake. Possum, we have to get to the other side of the bridge. See that battle bunyip? Maybe you can use it to clear the debris blocking the path. Oh, I got something. Don't know exactly what. Or is that just the, the music changing? Oh, no, it's just the music changing. <laughs> oh, nope, something was going on. Alright. Battle bunny up, left stick, uh, to move, jump with B, punch and throw with Y. When the power meter is at full, the bite button does a power slam. And here was another thing that they really promoted, were the mech suits that you could pilot in this game. <laughs> 
they're fun, uh, although there are some that are more fun than others, and, and I, I think I remember there's one, like, mech suit that you unlock that you only use once in the entire game, and then never again. It's that OP, huh? Uh, no, it is slow, and very, um, uh, minuscule when it comes to doing anything. Punch. Australia hard TPG smash. <laughs> <coughs> I'm right, I forgot I could actually punch uh, Slime Chezza. And then he died. So game's over, right? <laughs> uh. I didn't die, he did. Oh. Damn. Why oh damn? What, you wanted me to die? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Ow. It's okay, TBG. You go, oh, okay. Death, co dead. death comes for us all. I don't want it to come t too fast. I got, I got so much to live for still. Well, that's what you need. That's why you should have brought a towel. What? <laughs> because it came too fast. You said you didn't want it to come too fast. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just gonna oh, go ascend into God. another place. <laughs> you brought this on yourself! You said it, not me! <laughs> you implied it that way! You know me! <laughs> yes, I do. Alright, Y, Z, R, launch mortars, use left stick, aim. Does, it, does this also do gyroscopic? All right, all right, you know. Oh god, it does. Oh wait, what happened to the timeout redeems? I I got rid of them. Oh, I was about to give myself a timeout <laughs> because I kind of deserve one after that. Yeah, honestly, as much as I hate gyroscopic controls, they're pretty good in this. Gyro, you say? Yes. Hmm, gyros. Right. I've never had those. I know they're not actually pronounced gyro, but I like to do it, say it anyway, because I know so it's gonna make someone ang like irrationally angry. Okay, I take it back. I take it back. Oh. <laughs> Holy crap! And he's going down. Oh god! This is so awkward. Oh, please tell me. Let's see. Boomerangs, let's see that. Oh, I can change the color of the Jeep? Alright, well, what do we want? Do we want Bush Rescue? Go with the Hulk scheme. Oh. The Hulk scheme? Yeah. The cast mobile? Yes. Green and purple. It's the incredible Hulk mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what else? Ah, there we go. Controls. Controller, configure, gyroscope, off. Please, for the oh, oh, so that's holy. <clears throat> you know, the only game I played that had good gyroscopic controls was, um, I think it was called Heavenly Blade. Mm. I've heard of that, but I don't remember it. It was on PS2, 
three, I think? Yeah. yeah. I remember like, There's like one of the three games uh, really wanted to push gyroscopic controls. Yeah, but it was really good in there. It only happened with like one character, and like you could use it to like... Like, they were an archer, right? So whenever you fired a, an arrow, you could use gyroscopic controls to control where the arrow went. Huh. And you could do some cool flips with the with said arrows. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, there are so many mechs. Yeah, the gyroscopic controls on that game, if I remember correctly, were really tight. Like, I don't mean the slang term, I mean, like, it only moved as much as you moved the controller. Yeah, I, I will say this, gyroscopic controls for the PS3 were actually pretty good. Yeah. Like... Their controls had pretty good gyroscopes. Uh, the, 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 the... The hacking in, in Sly 4. I actually really like the gyroscopic controls in that. That's taking care of those demon fluffies, possum. Hang on, what's that? What do you think it is? Hmm, yes, a thousand fresh souls. A thousand a, th a thousand pieces of meat. <laughs> Fluffy. That gate leads to the old jail. Did you hear that sip? Yes, I heard it. Nice. Did you did you step away just so you could get uh something to sip for real? Oh no, when I ordered pizza, I also ordered a two liter of coke, and I poured some of it into a glass because I'm not a barbarian. Well, well, well. As much as I can watch anymore, I I wish I'm getting tired. All right, if you if you need to sleep, go to sleep. Oh, Moon's always tired. What does that lizard have boobs? Uh, well, how are you? Else, are you supposed to tell it's a female? I don't know. Voice, exactly. eyelashes. I don't know. <coughs> and yes, Tamo, no, I am tired. <laughs> no, I thought you were Moon. Ha 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 Good night, you two. Please, not the, <laughs> not the oh ho 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 ho. <laughs> You're hanging around with a bad smell. This is the best character in the game right here. She's piloting a green mech. That's the only <laughs> reason. That because it, just because it's green. Yes. Clearly, she has taste. Yeah, see, she she blends right in. Where did she go? <laughs> I don't know why, but her mech looks like something out of Mega Man Legends. What is going on with their eyes? Oh god! Honestly, there's only so many different ways you can make mechs. Your choices are basically Mega Man Legends, Gundam, and uh, Mech Warrior. Uh, I, I was gonna say uh, giant block, but then you said Mech Warrior, and it was basically the same thing. Yeah. Mega Man Legends being the well, cartooniest, her... and uh, Mech Warrior being the most pseudo realistic. Oops. I mean, bipedal mechs in general aren't realistic. But, you know. I don't know. W wasn't the the U.S. and Japan actually like building battle mechs for like a, a mech war that they were planning on doing? <laughs> no, no. I think I remember uh, reading something about that. The problem is there are so many engineering issues. Yeah. <laughs> Just jab. Finish it with a jab, Ty. Give him the old one two. You know, she's just giving you flat like haymakers. <laughs> Thanks, mate. I I was a gonna. Hmm. 
You know the most fun part of like uh A fisticuffs. Oh, like. what, what, what would that Every be? punch and kick has a name. <laughs> like drop kick, axe kick, <laughs> haymaker. <laughs> Do you know the difference between a haymaker and an axe kick? Uh, one's a punch, the other's a kick? <laughs> yes. But which one's the punch? The answer might- the answer might surprise you! 99% get this wrong! The punch kick. <laughs> yes. And it is with great pride that I cut this ribbon and officially declare open for Maji Bush Rescue! <laughs> I saw something glowing. I see something shimmery. That's you, possum. Get on ya, mate. Dennis, you won't regret this. With Bush Rescue, we're ready to take on Boss Kess the next time he strikes. Well, it's forgot how overly Australian this game is. Why not? I just got word that Cass has set up his own country just so we can have diplomatic immunity. You mean it's an immunity community? That stinker. Diplomatic waddy? As the newly elected president of Cassopolis, Boss Cass, and his diplomats are above the law as long as they're here on official Cassopolis business. They can double park. Open other people's mail and leave the milk out. And Sergeant Bluey can't touch him. Which is why it's important for us to find out what his plans are and catch him in the act. <sighs> well, there's no time to stand around gas bagging. We've got work to do. The local council has been complaining about crocodiles in the sewers, mate. Go see Ranger Ken to sort it out. Okay, oh hey, look, kangaroos. Julia Science Fact number 2223. Digital Rescue, the DRA. DRA is a portable computer that all Bush Rescue members carry. It is full of important information, including the rescue missions that you've been assigned. And press mice to open it up. Did you know that it was only due to the generosity of backers like down under gamer that I managed to increase the resolution of Ty's visual perception. You can discover all things in the credits. Oh, so I'm get. I wonder was this? I remember there being something about uh one of the back rewards was that you could make your own character and put it into the game, and I'm wondering if that's actually uh the character reward. Working for Bush Rescue. All right, there is something glowing back there, and I want to get to it. Uh. Warper Rain. The purple crystal behind the fence is a warp crystal. You can use the Warper Rain to teleport uh, next to it, which I do not have. There we go. Okay, there it is. Oh, that's trippy. Is it me or did they change the design of the the aqua rains? Because remember, like they weren't, they didn't have like a like swim trunks print on. It was more like uh, fins. Tigers are very hydrodynamic.
So we just keep grabbing all these opals. Yep, hold on, I'm getting an error claiming bonus points. Okay. Grab these, nope. grab these. Since Moon's not here, I'll do it myself. No! <sighs> God, what was this thing? You know, at this point I have enough soul juice left over to last me a month of sippage. Oh god. Frosted rains freeze enemies and put out fires. They also create ice that... Okay, so it's just like, come back here, we get all the many various rains. Ty, what are you doing? <laughs> Failing miserably. There we go. Alright, what else was there to explore? Alright, that's... This is just jumping. hate that you actually have to follow the... I think it was like in the original you could just keep tapping the A button or keep tapping the bite button and he would automatically follow it. But now it's like you also kind of have to follow the path with your controller. Mm -hmm. That awkward moment when, uh, you can't finish your pizza, but there's only one slice left, so it won't even make good leftovers. Oh god. Hmm? I said, oh god. About what? Like, one part. And that should... yep, that's it. Alright. Don't take it on me. <laughs> there are literally billions and billions of things that haven't been invented yet. I remember uh, just losing so many hours just exploring the base here as a kid. Mm -hmm. There was just there was just so many secrets here. It was insane. Or were you insane? Yes. All right. Usually you need a special ring to see the platforms, but it's actually really easy to see where they are. Yeah, they're all uh, wonky. All shimmery, super shimmery. Here. All right, let's see what is up here. Thanks to the eyewitness reports, we've been able to, to reconstruct the events of Boss Cass's escape from the prison. I suggest using my simulation. To, okay, so that's if you want to play the prologue again. I don't think that was in the original, which is nice that they added this. In fact, I don't remember this tower actually being in the original. It's a nice looking tower. It is a very nice looking tower. You know, for an Australian.
you know, I know some Australians, so I should probably ask them how they feel about this franchise, but they'll probably like the fact that they get some representation. That is it. That doesn't involve uh, making their con entire continent look like it's out to murder all life, all other life on this planet. So you mean so make their continent look accurate? Yeah. <laughs> Good eye, son. Glad you can make it into All right, I, I know that's a new one, the camera rain, which basically lets you take pictures that you can share. Screenshots with rain. filters. Zap, zap rain, infra rain, lash rain. Smash a rain. Super strong rain can break through even the toughest of metals. Very handy to have when you encounter steel crates. Mega rain. Using Julius's patented super seeking technology to make a rain has the ability to auto track enemies or auto target enemies. Useful for, for when Off you run into a bunch of Kaz's henchmen. This is ridiculous. All right, uh, let's get the flavor rains. Good choice, son. Bye, son. All right, uh, what is rain change? Okay, that's it. Oh, God, there... I think there's even more rains now than there were in the original Titan. Yeah, there were a bunch of rains that were, uh... Kickstarter goals. All right, so the sub key, thermo extreme, the lifter, which is completely useless, golden paw, doubles your health so you can take more damage. Oh, so that's... Oh, so that's what the cogs are for, so to get the new outfits. Hmm. We've got wetsuit. Uh, I think that's supposed to be a ninja cam uh, camo, and then you can get the different like decals for the trucks. And I don't see the one that you wanted, Tamo. Wait, what was the one I wanted? The the purple and uh, gray one, Wait, or the purple and green. You can't one. already make it purple and green. Bye bye. I don't. I don't think so. Let me check real quick. Wait, maybe it can. Oh, wait, it already is. Yay. Alright, uh, let's see. I'm guessing... Oh, there it Hulk is. Hulk truck. Alright, uh, we can actually change some of Ty's outfits. So, what what do we want? Do we want the, the festive one, which is just uh, changing his pants to the snowflake? The Doom Ranger, which is uh, all black, and then he's got like a, a rain thing on his chest. Mm -hmm. No, wait, we gotta go with Sight 2077. Uh, yeah! Hmm, green and black shorts. Nice. There, you get even more green. I am Robotai. Beep boop. F funny you say that. Robotai is actually somewhere in this town, I remember. I am the superior Robotai. Beep boop. I, I can actually run. <laughs> well, I, I am quite acrobatic. Oh, ow. Why was I still programmed to feel pain? Because pain reminds you of things you should not be doing! <laughs> Such as banging your head against a wall. Or smashing your hand with a hammer. Or putting your other I hand on an it. oven. Why would I put my hand in an oven? I meant the stove. My apologies. Alright, where, where is, uh, Robotai? Hello, toy. Uh, I have to eat this last slice. It's not even gonna be good for leftovers. Because it's just one. Don't make yourself sick still. Mmm. You're right, I can have a side with this thing later, so. Not perfect. I'm gonna at least put it in the oh, fridge. Right, I forgot this thing. Whatever the hell this thing is. Oh, hey, it's a flying monkey. Or. What's it say? I need it. <laughs> 
What? Alright, be right back. Okay. Hey there, Ty. Oh, God. I am getting out of here. God, why are you trying to burn a bunch of tires? Oh, that the smell's gonna be atrocious. Invisible up here. No, oh, just opals. Find Robotai somewhere. Is he more up towards the mansion? Or is he more down in the, the main city? your mum, don't you? Sometimes. It's okay, mate. Your dad's worried sick about you. How about we get you home before it gets too late? Okay. I've got an interesting job for you, mate. Julius needs you at the Gunner Gunner training grounds to test his latest invention. Cool. Alright. Uh, let's see. Grab those. Was there anything else? I think it was just the kid. I mean, I know there's like something up there. There's a cog up there. I need to figure out how to get. Dennis's nephew, aren't you? Why, yes, I am. People call me Claren. So, what are you doing all the way up here by yourself, Clary? I'm on a dare to enter the grounds of Gruesome Bottom Manor. The famous Baramaji Haunted Mansion. Haunted? You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Of course I do. Some of my best friends are ghosts. They're quite friendly, actually. But there's one ghost who's really mean and won't let me in. Tell you what, mate. I'll go and see if I can sort him out for you. Would you? Thanks a lot, Ty. Need an infrared or the x ray to complete the mission. You can buy them at the shop. And they won't even let me go. Will they actually let me go in there?
I see some blocks up there. <coughs> Which means I Hi, can melt toy. them. Good day, young toy. Oh, I need the lasso rings for this one. That's to take me all the way to there. That goes to there, that goes to there, that goes to that. Don't... Okay, I think I see what I need to do for that one. And that just takes me to... I have so much ice cream stack. Oh, no. <laughs> I am jealous. I got a couple drumsticks and a couple uh, ice cream sandwiches. There, I, I found Robotie. He is talking to a uh, giant inflatable alligator tie. Nice. Hello, other Robotie. Beep. Nice, uh, nice, uh, Utonium. Fuck. Nice reactor core you have. Nice reactor core you have. Um. Did your mother install it? Haha, ha, loser. He's just jealous because you're mobile. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. That, that's a cog that you can use to buy the other skins. Yeah, but you skip an entire puzzle to get to it. No, th that, w that was the puzzle to get to it. The other puzzles to get the, the sphere thing. Oh. Hmm. The drumsticks need to soften up a bit. Alright, time to kill gators. Yay! Not well, they actually uh, they actually fixed the lighting issue that was down here in the original. Hey. Yeah, uh, in the original Titan, I remember it like being super dark down here, so the gators would sneak up on you easier because you wouldn't know where they were until it was too late. And if I remember right, there was also, like, a really weird character down here that, if you talk to, you got a bunch of opals for. I just need to remember where exactly uh, he's hiding. Is that what those old orbs are? Opals? Yes. Hmm. I think it was in this, like, round area. He's in one of these, like, one-off sections. We're in a one-off section. I think this was it. Nope. Nope, not here. Not here, but I do see something shimmering up there. It's more art. Fancy. Yep. Look how the, with this costume, your face paint is pink, like you're constantly blushing. <laughs> Robotai is embarrassed! Why would I pick a job that is so dirty? My servos are going to rust. Oh shit. I just realized that this is a sewer level. I hate sewer levels. They smell like poo <laughs> gas. Nope, not here. He's down here somewhere. I know it. I think I already covered this, but I just want to do one more run around to be sure. Yeah. Hmm. 
Oh, and I froze some damage, of course. Yay! Frozen chocolate is the best chocolate. Oh, it is. Especially when you get that crunch. Uh huh. How do you know those are there? Hmm? Oh, never mind. I was wondering how you knew those were all there. Uh, I can see the shimmer. Yeah, I saw it too. That's why I said never mind. Alright, uh, let's see. That's the exit, which means I'm going to go this way. I mean, this way. There's still an entire section of sewer that I haven't explored yet. There's still an entire gator he haven't killed yet. Found him. There he is! I knew he was still down here somewhere. Both of them, little orange dinosaur. You're not one of them, are you? No, you're too small and fuzzy. Say, I've got some Google juice. Do you want some? Ah, uh, you don't look old enough. Tell you what, I do have something in my life. I found them while digging up some Google berries. You can have them. And he just gives you a bunch of opals. Mm. He's a weird character who shows up uh, every now and then. I, the only other place I remember seeing him is like later into the game uh, when you can finally go to a uh, Sly Shop because he sells you rain upgrades. And he's like just sitting outside the shop. But I know he shows up in some other locations. I just don't know exactly where. You did a great job of clearing the sewers of all those crocs, mate. I just got off the blower from Lake Baramaji Refinery. They've got a load of unstable dynamite that needs disposal. And guess what? They want you to do it. <laughs> I gotta do everything around here. We'll do one more quest, which was back at base, and then we'll swap to the next game. Actually, no, I can get the infrared. I can go back up to the mansion and do that quest now. Let's do this. Yikes! Oh my goodness! All right. I think if I remember right, he is there. He is. And there we go. There he is. Yay! Oh, you did it! 
He didn't stand a ghost of a chance against you. <laughs> he didn't stand a ghost of a chance. Uh, uh, TBT. Yes. Did you know that he didn't stand a ghost of a chance? I did not know that he didn't stand a ghost of a chance. How the hell am I supposed to get up to the rooftop? Hey, TPG. Yes. What do you call him? It's a ghost of a chicken. A poultry guy. Yes. <laughs> a poultry guy. How am I supposed to get up there? Hmm. This next one's pretty lame. Um, what do you call a pair of ghost bees? Boobies. Yes. Have I told you that before? No, it was just really easy to, to figure out. You're the only one who's done it. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't know. I think if Moon were here, she probably would have figured it out, too. You're the only one so far and then... that has figured it out. Hooray! Why didn't the ghost go to the dance? Good I die. Mm -hmm. Cause he would kill it on the dance floor? Cause he didn't have the guts. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. There's another version of that where it's a skeleton. Get the camera rain at least. I still need around 200 more opals. Why did the of ghost course, go to the blood I'm... bank? Why? To donate some of his ectoplasma. Uh. <laughs> I wish Moon were here. Is... She'd appreciate my jokes. Hello, boy. Uh, Appreciate is a weird way to just say groan. <laughs> she chuckle at at least one of them. Uh, let's all be honest here. It'd probably be the boobies one. Probably. Hmm. What else do I got? Yeah, I got nothing else on the ghost joke from. What, what's a ghost's favorite lunch meat? Hmm. Bouloni. Hmm. What's Frankenstein's favorite cheese? Oh. Monster. <sighs> Get out. Okay, bye. No, Tim, wait! And then there was one. Oh, oh no, she's back. <laughs> okay, I see. Your kids. I see what I'm not wanted. What do that. Ba -ding. Is, is that your your uh, joining sound? Just ba -ding. Ba -ding. <laughs> yes. Hello, Ty. Good eye, Ty. Right, no, uh, there we go. And got it. All right, got our two thousand. Let's go get that camera Hello, rain. Ty. Ow. Camera only costed one thousand. Was it one thousand? It was just one. Yeah, it's one thousand. <laughs> That's a rip of a rank, so. This thing has no aerodynamics to it. It's just a straight line. Bye, son. Oh, where? Color normal.
complete with Snapchat filters. Yep. I call this Ty tries to jaywalk. <laughs> Beep boop, yes I am normal, regular Tasmanian tiger, how could you tell? <laughs> Gets punched in the gut. Ow. My nutrient processor. <laughs> nutrient processor? Seriously? Yeah, that's what the stomach is for. <laughs> My consumable storage device. There we go. Wouldn't that be wherever your body stores fat? What does it look like? I'm working, mate. Not all is it's about. Damn it, you, you know. got me there. Fair enough. <laughs> My name's Snaith, and me mate over there is Keith. Good day. I'm the cook, and he's the mechanic. Although we sometimes swap jobs. Either way. Snaith and Keith. Hi! <laughs> the way he was waving his arm at you was unsettling. If you want to scrub up on your rescue skills, just meet me over at that sign. Alright, because I know this counts as a mission. Right, oh mate. First thing you need to know is how to get a better look around the place. You can do that by using the right stick. Just oh god, I forgot this guy's voice. Spin the camera around. And you can move the camera distance in and out by pressing up and down on the directional buttons. Mate, did you know that you can tailor the camera to your liking? Cool. If you haven't worked it out already, mate, you can use those legs of yours to jump. It's mate. Really press the jump button to get Did you know that you can turn your camera to your liking? Tamo, I didn't know you were a character in this game. <laughs> Good day, mate. I'm gonna put some prawns on the barbie. <laughs> Here's a skill that should come in handy. See these floating thingamajigs? They're called spy eggs. Yeah, it turns out for some reason we in America call shrimp call prawns shrimp. Just like Billy the chain biting Bilby from Bruna. Right out. Beauty is, you can chain bite your way up to hard to reach places. Why don't you give it a go? Oh, God! Ah, my ears. I'm sorry. No, they they jumped and then went to light speed. Ah. Uh, you know Sonic Boom! Wings? That's right. You can hold them out and use them to glide across wide gaps. Jeez, this ice cream sandwich is not going to get eaten. That's too damn bad. <laughs> Can you glide through the sky Dude, like that's too bad. Um. <laughs> Nom. Glenn the Gliding Goose from Glen Eye. Like, what? <laughs> well, look at here. So many analogies. Like a big bar, but you wouldn't know what I think you mean uh, alliteration. That's, what I, that's the word. And the analogy is when you compare things. Uh, it, listen, it's late. My brain's uh, mush at the moment. I like analogy. You can't spell it without a body word. You can swim all right, mate. Yep, that, that naughty word of G. I know, right? It's so, so filthy. God, I can't believe you said it on stream. Ah, uh, man, the audience is virgin ears. I'm gonna have to hashtag cancel you on Twitter now. Oh, no. Ah, oh, gee, ah, oh, crap. Mm. <laughs> you did it again! Ah, uh, I can't stop. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Ah! If you want to get off, just press the jump button. I reckon you'll... Anyway, an analogy is a comparison between two things, typically for the purpose of explanation or clarification. See that target way up there? If you hold down Ty's view button, you'll get a range-eye view of the place. You can throw your rings with greater accuracy this way. 
Why don't you give it a go now? Careful, mate. There's a big drop just ahead. You know how he taught you to glide across gaps, right? Well, if you ever jump off a cliff, you can reach the bottom safely by gliding. Yeah, mate, go on. Jump off this cliff and give it a go. I don't like that two strangers told me to go jump off a cliff. I can't believe two strangers just told you to jump off a cliff. How rude. That's pretty freaking rude. The ability to lock onto a bad guy and always hit him with your rings. When you see a bad guy, press the lock on button. While you hold the button down, you'll always face your phone. Is that something you were already doing? It'll head right for him no matter which what? locking on. Have a go on this fella. Nope. Here. It's actually you honestly don't even need to lock on. I think aside from like maybe like one or two moments because it's like see these rails. Well, your you, your reins kind of do track two driving. enemies. It's a great way to get around the place. Why don't you give it a burl? Well, if you jump at it, you can start grinding. Really? Really? I miss Bob. We all do. I miss me too. Well done, mate. Hey, Bob's back. Hello. Rescue trick in the book. There's a bunch of Hollywood Bob, what have you been up to all the time? Oh, you know, clubbing. Does it mean you're going to clubs or uh, hitting people with a club? My lawyer says I'm not supposed to talk to you anymore. <laughs> oh, Bob. Damn it, that's the third time I've heard that this week. Hard what? Oh. Uh. We're not supposed to talk. The lawyer thing. Poor TDG. Alright, was there a secret around here? I think so. Alright, I need the, the electric cranes for this to get to the opals up there. TBG, what did you do to earn the ire of so many uh, lawyers? Uh, we, we don't talk about the dark times. <laughs> ah, yes, Listen, the dark I, times. I, 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 I played that Frogger game and just I I scarred people so badly they put they sent cease and desist after me. <laughs> Understandable. That game should be illegal. I'm pretty sure that game is against the Geneva I, Conventions. I think it's against more than just the Geneva Conventions. What does that say up there? Plot twist at some point. On Tam streams. That's on some game. I don't know yet. I'm gonna end up using the Geneva Conventions as a to do list. Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, all you have to do uh, if you need to figure out what to do for, to violate the Geneva Conventions is just to look up uh, on Twitter of what games violate the Geneva Conventions and just do that. No, that's not good enough. I need to throw. I need to do stuff like throwing uh, thermite rounds at villagers in Minecraft. You can play Sly Two and violate the Geneva Convention by torturing a prisoner of war. That works. <laughs> All right, I think that is everything to do at the base right now. So yeah, uh, still a pretty good. Uh, HD port, I really like it. I might actually make this a future series, but I kind of want to play the first tie game before we come back to this. But yeah, I've been having a fun time playing this. So for now, uh, let's jump to intermission real quick and go to the last game of the night. By the way, All right. did you know? That if you want to mute a stream but still be counted as a viewer, you should mute the tab instead of the Twitch player. Mm -hmm. That way it still counts you as a viewer. Did you also know that you have to have sent something in the chat once every 20 to 30 minutes to still be counted as a viewer? I did not know that. Now you do.
The more you know. Do, 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 do. All right, so final game of the night is a game that actually came out today. Well, I guess technically yesterday now because it is uh, April 8th. Uh, we're going to round out the night by playing some Pac-Man 99. Oh, boy. Mario died so Pac-Man could live. <laughs> I'll see you on just a bit. Okay, in the back. Welcome back. What's up with that uh, screaming jello blob thing? He's screaming because it's so windy. He he's getting all wiggly. I'm more concerned of, as to why Ed is eating a lava lamp. <laughs> Alright. That's not the strangest thing right. he's eaten. I mean, he ate his entire yeah. mattress before. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, one of my favorite parts of, <laughs> of that episode. Now eat your mattress. Yum. Yum. <laughs> he just swallows it all. It, 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 excuse me, Ed. Is this your good lord, man? <laughs> <laughs> the, the fact that he literally swallows it whole <laughs> and then just goes back to normal is the best part. Uh, do you got a fan on Tamu? I do. Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're fine. Nope, right, I'm so pointing it away now. It's too late. No, don't put it. No. I will melt now. <laughs> There's DLC for the. Is there? I'm guessing those are probably just like background skins. 
Oh, no, wait, no, that's not it. Character it's skins. uh, character skins. Oh man, they got Dig Dug. I might actually. Is that uh, a mouse? DLC. Yes, I believe. Uh, I don't remember what it was, but I remember playing it. Uh, it was another. It was another Namco character. Ah, uh, it's driving me insane. They're all Namco characters there. I might actually uh, pick this up just to, because if I can play as uh, Dig Dug during Pac-Man, that's great. Can you can you play as the mouse for me? Actually, how much is it? I am curious. So does the fact that this game has DLC mean it's safe from N Nintendo's wrath? Uh, what do you mean? Ooh, ooh. Let's see, Metal Unlock, Namco Classic 1. Alright, so there it is. Uh, Namco Classic 2, Galaga, Dig Dug, Genji, Dragon Buster, Legend of Valkyrie, Cosmo Gang, Namco Classic, Rolling Thunder, Wonder Woman Mo. Wow, there are a lot. Is it just basically every Namco game? I don't know. Keep scrolling and find out. Bravo Man, Namco Classics 5. And then you can buy them all for, uh, or you can get the deluxe pack for thirty bucks, or the mode unlock for fifteen. Hmm. Cool. I might pick up the Dig Dug one, but for now we're just gonna play with standard. Dig Dug was weird. Uh, depends on which version of Dig Dug you were playing. Like inflating your enemies to kill them. Oh, okay, yes, then I can see it. It, it was m the more graphic Mr. Driller. Because yeah. it involved digging. And then many years later, I found out inflation is a fetish. Oh, God. Are you saying Dig Dug was the contributor to it? Who knows? I'm not saying he's not. Like how Lola Bunny was a huge contributor to, uh, furries. TPG, are you okay? Okay, that was that was that was that was a fluke start. <sighs> We're gonna do it right this time. You weren't even the first to die. <laughs> How did that happen? I I don't know. I panicked, okay? I saw a ghost coming one way, figured I couldn't munch the ghost in time, so I went the other way, then I doubled back because I double-guessed myself. Ooh! There we go. Nom 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 Oh dear. Oop! Ah, ah, I didn't mean to go up. You okay? Oh, you died. 83! I was actually really good at Pac-Man when I was a kid. There, there was a Pac-Man game, I think it was for the PSP. If anyone even remember, remembers that uh, console. I remember and... that console. Remember that it, w it was actually like really fun. Ooh! He's right on your own butt. Don't worry, we're safe. Got him all. Nice. Ooh.
You know those false Pac-Men slow you down. Oh, they do? Yeah. No, 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 no! I shall consume, consume, consume everything! Said Pac-Man, who's totally not a villain. Ooh, oh, now they start moving. Oh dear. I believe they're hunting you down. What? There we go. Top 50. Oh boy. Oh no. Everything's faster now. Oh god. Oh baby. Ah damn it. The Pac Man confused me. Oh no. You're on the top 40 at least. Yee. Just barely by one. Do you think my crunching is annoying? Nah. Let's see. So it should oh, crunch right louder. Here. Got it. Jerry. Got it. Ooh. Oh, God. Get this train. Come on, get up. There we go. Oh, God. I got trapped. Should have boldly gone for that power pellet. Yeah, probably should have. I can see why people get knocked out super fast. Oh, jeez, you never clear your reward request queue, do you? Nope. It's backed up I'm from five for years ago. Have you even been streaming Wait, for five, five years? Wait, what? what? What's five years? I think your reward request queue is backed up to about five years. Have you even been streaming that long? No. Mm, maybe I read something wrong. Anyway. Ooh, go for it. There we go.
Okay. Oh boy, oh three. That should be everything. Oh what? Almost. Oh. Yeah, I hate that. They turn. Yeah, but I just picked up a power pellet. I don't know why they went uh, back to normal so fast. Hmm. This. Oh, no, 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 Cherry. That's a strawberry. Strawberry. Same thing. Not really. P potato, potato. They're hunting you. They're both berries. They were, but now I'm the hunter. Actually, a strawberry is not a true berry. So its name is a lie? Its name is a lie. I've been bamboozled the this entire time. Yay, top uh, 50. Get him. Get that pellet. <laughs> 69. Nice. Nice. I will say, it is super satisfying when you get a nice... Tr oh, wow, I knocked out, like, five people there. There, I need to get the pellet. No, no. I got slowed. Yeah, that's what they do. Let's see. Like thirty-two. Out John. Just tell me the other person is Cena. V man, and that was it. Aw, if you knocked out John and Cena, that would have been amazing. <laughs> He knocked out John Cena. All both of them. He's so powerful he could play this game twice. Do one controller for each hand? No, he's playing them with his feet. Oh no! Let's do this. It's weird that they run away from you at first. There we go. Got that train going. You okay, TPG? Yep. I just almost I just got see a Pac Man uh, ambushed by a ghost. Out.
cherry. Yum. Strawberry. There's that train I want. Now you fear. Oh, no, they're all after me. I know how it feels to sip a thousand souls. Te technically, in a, in a weird sort of roundabout way, that is exactly what I'm doing. You're nomming on ghosts. On those poor Spookletons. Ah! Damn it. Oh. I missed the time. I was I was trying to go for that pellet. It seems like the pellet's last uh shorter. A lot sh shorter as the, the match goes yeah. on. Makes sense. We've got to make it harder for the the better players. That train going. I like trains. <laughs> oh no. Is it gonna be real good or real bad? Oh god! Ah! Slowed. Maybe I should be using the D-pad for this. I was trying to go for that one pellet, but I didn't see the Pac-Man go uh, slow me down. Might have a problem. Oh, nope, there we go. Are you sure about that? No. There we go. Wow, already top fifty. <gasps> oh god, got it just in time. Oh, 
yes, give me that train. I think I might accidentally be breaking the ghost because I'm getting them in such a weird order. Hmm. Well, uh, unbreak ghosts. Uh, I'm scared of what that red is. Why don't you touch it and find out what it is? Oh, nope, he's after me. The red is after you? Yes. Oh, God! Hot twist, that's ah! like another ghost. Hey, guess what? I I got rank 5. Nice. You let yourself get trapped. <laughs> I know. I got I got scared. Uh, you know what? I want to see Dots eaten 456. No KOs. Oh, I was so close to rank 1. We almost got there. Almost. What are we at? Uh, I could probably go for a little bit longer. I actually do have the energy to do so, and this is actually pretty fun. So, Tamo, out of all the Nintendo BR games that have come out in the the past like year and a half, what would you say so far seems to be the best? Nintendo what games? Battle Royale. Oh, okay. You know, Mario, I thought you said, Mario 35. Yeah, I thought I, I thought I heard BR, but I thought I also heard a VR. So I was like, wait, what? Nintendo's thinking of doing uh, VR. Yes. Nani? <laughs> Nani core. Uh, you you wish. Um, kind of. I mean, I don't have VR, so it's hard for me to wish. Oh, TPG, you're consuming all of the pellets. Oh. I must consume. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Oh. Get those ghosts. Consume those spirits. But I don't have any alcohol. Waka waka. What? Ah, damn it. I thought pink got me. I didn't see that blue was on my tail. Hmm. TBG, don't you know, in order to excel, Pac-Man and I need to be on every single dot at the same time. <laughs> and every ghost. Every ghost? All of them. Basically, your eyes have to be on everything that is a thing. Simultaneously. Basically, my, my, my eyes just need to be, like, <laughs> bouncing all over the place.
Yep, there's a strawberry. Because I know for a fact I was still going up. Gonna be a big train. some fruit right about now. There we go. Oop, nope, nope, nope. I get it. There we go. Oh, yep. Red is danger. Red straight up tries to kill you. I figured it was just going to be like a, a super slowdown. But no, it is indeed death. The red is death? Yes, the red is death. Oh, it is. And now I know, and knowing is half the battle. Yes, and now you know to avoid it at all costs. Especially since power pellets do nothing. Yeah. I hate the fact that power pellets do nothing against red.
Give it a strawberry. In there. Wow, already red? <laughs> so it seems like red shows up around the 35 mark. Alright. We'll do maybe three more matches and then we'll call it for tonight because it is getting super late. And I need to get to sleep. Okay, so that's what the meter in the middle is. That's the power pellet time. Oh. I honestly thought for the longest of times that was like the meter you need to, to count down to the next fruit. I thought that was a meter for like, uh, this is when the ghosts respawn. Holy crap, look at that chain. Yep. There's so long the you couldn't get to best. it. <laughs> couldn't get all of it. It was so long that I, that I broke it. It was so long you wouldn't it wouldn't let you grab anymore. Oh, you had two more to grab before you get that. Get it! Got it! Nice. Look at this chain! No, 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 no. Wow, thirty-two. Yep. And you can still make another chain. Or maybe not. Maybe. Come on, go, 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 go! Get it. There we go. Apple. Those things really slow you down. Oh yeah, they do. And guess what? Uh. The, it seems like the power pellet runs out faster as time goes. Oh god, why are there so many reds? There's two reds. There's more than just two reds, Tamo. There's four. Try about uh, six. See, I'm very far behind. Ooh, ooh, ooh. How, how, how? How did you survive that? I don't How know. Are you still I literally alive? passed through a ghost. I don't know, but I'll take it. Ah! Oh, hey, God. oh, God. Oh, <laughs> God. He was oh. right on your ass. 
Let me let me consume those melons. Melon. Oh god, it's almost instantaneous now uh, for the pellet to run out. Oh god, those things are slowing you down more and more. Pellet. No, 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 no. Oh god, um, I'm out. Ah, number two. Nice. Number three. Hey, top three. Let's have a picture of that. Ah, oh, so close. Wow, it gets really crazy uh, when it comes down to the wire. Just like, I blinked and my power pellet was running out. I probably would have gotten a knockout had they not put a red right in front of me. Yeah. Uh. Because that broke the chain and I couldn't recover from it. I still would like to know how the hell I phased through that ghost. Because I know for a fact that I should have been dead there. Unless there was like a, a fraction of a second to... Uh, save myself uh, from getting numbed because I still had like... A fraction of a second of a power pellet left in me. Fruit? Fruit? I need fruit! Thank you. Uh, I'm trapped. There was no getting out of that. Okay, one more match. Wait, what? God, I, I'm, I'm scared to think of just, like, the insane uh, types of trains people would be making.
Crap, reds are here. Oh! Mm. Damn. All right. <laughs> Back to the main menu. Let's see. Emblems. Oh, you get all the emblems already un unlocked. Or, I guess. Play with Genji in the... X Clan, Yokai Dochi, Dragon Buster, Legend of Valkyrie, Cosmo Gang, Namco Classics 3. Sure, uh, I'll, I'll be naked, dude. Let's see, Roll the Thunder, Wonder Momo, Xavius, Barduke, Return to Ishtar, Namco Classics, Classics, Bravo Man, Star. Get a score of 10 points or higher in score attack. 50,000, 100,000, 200,000, And stop the timer during score attack. A score of 2,500,000 points in score attack for the final one. Get a certain number of fruits. Complete uh, blind time attack. See, there's the okay, Namco Classics 2, Gilgamesh or Tyra Draga, Namco Classics 1, and Car. Let's see, we got Bold Arcade, uh, Blocky, Ne uh, let's see, oh, there's Lego. Oh god, that is weird to look at. That is going to throw people off big time. Let's see, ice, garden, house, uh, flower garden, sky. Oh wait, that's a uh, red baron. Oh, it also changes the ghosts in Pac-Man too. That's cool. Classics 2. There's the Dig Dug. There's the Genji. Yokai. Dungeon Buster. Legend of Valkyrie. Cosmo Gang. Classics 3. Rolling Thunder. Wonder Momo. That looks. Oh, God, that actually kind of hurts to look at. Uh, Xavius. Barduke. Return to Ishtar. Or Return of Ishtar. Classics. Classics. And then Bravo Man. Which is probably the the, be the best looking of, out of all of them. But if anything, I'd probably go with Dig Dug. I didn't mean to hit the A button by accident. All right. Let's go to the break. All right. Well, tonight was definitely interesting. We had we had some fun. We had some laughs. And we had uh, some things that made me contemplate life itself. What'd you think, Tamo? Mm hmm? About uh, Pac-Man 99? Pac-Man 99 and all the other games that we did tonight. Hmm. Or at least that you were here for. Meat. Meat. Meat for the meat god. Become as meat. Meat is as meat does. Consume. Alright. Uh, let's... Uh, I don't know. Complete meat. And... 
this is probably a long shot, but we'll see if this person is still streaming right now. If not, then I already got a fallback target. What else did you play? Uh, let's see, we played EX Troopers, which was the Super Anime Lost Planet game. I meant what I was here for. Oh, uh, Ty? Oh yeah, Ty. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. So, um, mm -hmm. there was a meat game. There was a, I literally forgot it game. And, um, mm -hmm. yes. Pac-Man. Because it was entirely necessary. I don't know, maybe right, I'm uh, becoming jaded in my old in, olden years. Because when I saw that announcement, I was like, oh god, another one? <laughs> Alright, uh, we shall go raid John, who is playing through some Enter the, the Gunja right now. Enter the Dungeon. I've heard that's a really good game. Enter the Dungeon. Alright, we're gonna raid John with hashtag, uh, become as meat. Become as meat. Become as meat. I, I, honestly, it was either that or meat cheese. <laughs> Alright. Uh, schedule. Tomorrow, new slides going up. Uh, should be around the afternoon, so hopefully. I already got all the editing done, I just need to schedule the upload, and I just ran out of time before the stream started. Other than that, uh, the poll for Game Clearing is going to close at 6pm tomorrow, so if you haven't voted and you're a part of the community or the any of the other discords that I posted the, the poll in, uh, definitely cast your vote while you still can. Uh, because tomorrow is the game clearing that w wins whatever it is. Friday, of course, return to Yakuza. I'm gonna die because Dragon's gonna inflict cat shoes on me. And yeah, that is basically it for tonight. That's the schedule for the week. Hope you all had a good time. I will see you all tomorrow for something that I don't know because I have not checked the poll in a while. So... Whatever wins, wins. See you all next time. Good night, everybody. Because oh my God. Meat. Meat. Meat.